Hi, Beck. Beck's first in the meadow. How are you, Beck? Hello, how is everybody? I hope everyone had a great, long freaking weekend. Go! <laughs> Let's go back. Tina! Hi, Tina! <laughs> Hi, Grimmy! How was the uh, how's the rest of your day, Grimmy? Thank you for the candy! Toya! Hi, Toya! Hi, Toya! Hi, Toya. Hi, Toya. Hi Tina! Hi, Lizzie! Hi, Grimmy. Hi, hi. I'm chilling and stitching. Happy to be here. Let's go. It's been so quiet on Twitch. It's been so quiet on Twitch. So I've been just hanging out. I'm missing all the friends, though. I'm definitely missing all the friends. Christmas was great. Christmas was a chill day. It was a really, really chill day. Quiet. For the most part. It was fine. <laughs> I love that. I love that it was at least fine, Groovy. <laughs> Tiny Stitcher! Hello, how are you? Yeah, we're gonna knit. I don't know what else to do right now, honestly. Um... I don't know. I could cross stitch, but I don't have a Twitch particular project that I'm like in the mood to work on at the moment. And then I was like, well, I have my diamond painting, but I'm going to be doing diamond painting this weekend with Casa. We're going to do a kit up for the 2024 Depal. Is that's not it? That's the old one. This one. We're doing a, a kit up co stream over on Casa's channel. Um. And it's gonna be at seven so we're doing that this weekend so i'm like do i want to do diamond painting today i don't know and this is really i mean i have a couple projects but <sighs> nothing that i touched in a while so it's gonna take a minute for me to like figure it out but i've been working on this like off and on so i figure i'll pull this out today but that's gonna be on saturday but this is how much i have so far i've got Pretty good chunk into the scarf now but I got a ways to go so this is gonna take a while <laughs> this is gonna take a while to get there here I can show you it's like a sweater so it's like here we do chatting oh, you still can't see it of course <laughs> but there's like the sweater part and then this would like wrap around, I guess, through the back, and then wrap to the front, or the front to the back, I don't know. But that's what I have so far. I like it. I love it. I love the colors very, very much. And I love the stripes. Happy Boxing Day to all the Canadians and Commonwealth folks out there. I have no idea what Boxing Day is about. I always hear it and I always forget about it. But I have no idea what Boxing Day is. And then I saw someone explain it. Something about big companies giving their boxes to their employees or something? I don't know. I've actually never understood. Like, like I said, I always thought it was about boxing. <laughs> I always thought it was uh, about actual boxing. And then I realized today somebody had talked about it and I was like, oh, it's not actually about boxing. <laughs> I'm a little late to that party. <laughs> yeah, it was a good Christmas. It was just quiet. Who is that? Claire! Claire! Craziness at 14 freaking months tier freaking three, Claire. I'm so bad. 
You know, the other day, Pix was like, oh yeah, I give an hour of my time for all my tier threes. And we just do whatever they want to do for an hour every month. And I was like, that is such a great idea. So I'm going to have to find something to implement for any tier three. Tweer? 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 I will say it again. <laughs> Any tier threes, I'm gonna have to like, think of something really fun to do. And then I'm gonna have to make it up to all my tier threes <laughs> for this whole time. So yeah. Thank you, Claire. Thank you so much for the 14 months. How is everybody? How was everybody's weekend? How was the holiday? Welcome back, Lizzie. How are you, Lizzie? Erica! Hi, Erica! Perfect timing. Just broke up with Gail for... <gasps> for Halston! I feel awful! I'm gonna play tomorrow. I was like, do I play more Baldur's Gate today? But I was like, this is my comeback to stream day after the long weekend. So I was like, I'm gonna be really chatty or gonna wanna talk a lot. So I was like, let me do a craft stream today and then I'll do Baldur's Gate probably the next three days. <laughs> next three days or so. <laughs> so yeah, so today is just crafts just because I knew I want to be chatty chatty today. But yeah, but you better believe tomorrow we're getting back into it. I'm so excited. I do, I've, I've looked at it all week and I'm like, all I want to do is play Baldur's Gate, but I can't touch it until I'm streaming. And yes, I could probably record it, but I'm in like bum mode mom right now. Mom, mom bum, I was mom bumming it. <laughs> I was like, I have no desire to like fix my hair or like put on clothes. <laughs> so we're not gonna, we're not gonna record. So I can't play. So I'm like, I've been dreaming about it. I'm dreaming about it. Nothing much else happened after we Ah, come on! Maybe tomorrow, Grimmy. Maybe tomorrow. We just finished redoing the craft room, so I've been diamond painting like crazy. Let's go! I love that. I love new tr new crafter uh, organization vibes. It's always really inspiring when you like fix up your your craft area. Did you download Epics? I didn't, Josh. I didn't. I ended up getting busy. I went and made dinner and everything. So I didn't get a chance to do it. It looked like a cool game, though. It looked like a little puzzle game. It's a puzzle game, right? It looked like a little cozy puzzle game that I was interested in. I dig this letter. Thank you, Art. Thank you, Erica. Jam! <gasps> Jam! A whole year, Jam! Get out of here! That's freaking wild! Thank you so much for the for the reset for 12 months, Jem. Jem, what are you doing? <laughs> are you still hanging out? I know it's been a year. That's bizarre. That's bizarre that I've known you for a year. Honestly. That's crazy. I'm, st I'm mind blown. Can you tell? <laughs> Can you tell I'm mind blown? That's insane. Thank you for the resub, Gem. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. What are you doing? What are you doing right now? But thank you. I, I'm really loving this sweater so far. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I wanted to craft a bit more than what I did, but I did do a bit of knitting over. You did some knitting, Grimmy? I love to see that. I love to see that. I'm glad you got a lot of crafts in. Like I said, I, I've just worked on this mostly this weekend more than anything else. Uh, I played a lot of Sandrock. A uh, little bit of Dreamlight Valley. That's about it though. I don't know, I was kind of sitting around most of the weekend. Rework for you. Thank you for the chocolate! Yeah, I was sitting around for most of the weekend to be honest. I don't know, it's kind of weird. It's kind of weird vibe. But I had peace and quiet because my kids were distracted with their gifts, so... <laughs> what is going on? Who is that? Who is it? Who is up? Josh! 24 months, Josh. Two freaking years. Two freaking years. We met two years ago? I missed if you answered my question. Did you get the game? Josh! <laughs> well, now you gotta wait longer because I just put candy in my mouth. <laughs> Blackout syndrome. 
them. Wait a minute. Are you Anson? No. Anson is Anson. I met you recently, no? How are you? Welcome in. Saint originally, then it became our version of Black Friday before Black Friday was a thing. Oh, I see. I see. I always hear the term, but I don't, I only know there's like a couple sales. I never think it's like anything super big. I'm so behind on freaking chat right now. <laughs> what? Okay, I'm good. I'm gonna catch up. It's chaos right now. Iron, how is Baldur's Gate? Iron, I promise you I've been lurking on you on you the last three days, four days, however long you've been playing Baldur's Gate. I just can't watch because of spoilers. But I'm there. I'm there in the shadows. And I peek over at you every now and then and I see something and I'm like, no, I can't see that. <laughs> I can't see it. There's always some something really cool happening every time I peek over. So I have you tab, but you're in the background. How is your stream though? How's Baldur's Gate going? Welcome in readers. I'm super behind. Hold on. I'm a speed read. I'm a speed read. Um, I didn't download the game because I forgot Josh. I went to make dinner and I totally got sidetracked. Um, but I wanted to check it out. It's a puzzle game, right? It looked like a really cute, cozy puzzle game. And I wanted to check it out. It's nothing just about a saint, but it's just a bank holiday. Some people like to say it's the day people box up their Christmas gifts. Ah, oh, their Christmas stuff. Got it. Hi, Militant. They deserve nothing. They will give you money and like it. Hi, Militant. How are you? Hello, Kristen. Just take our money. <laughs> no, I want to I wanna send love back. I want to send love back. Gail was moving so fast for me, like he's deeply in love and it freaked me out. See, I'm telling you, Gail's like a like a sappy romantic that's like, like, I don't know. He's just not what I'm interested in. <laughs> I know everyone's like, oh, he's easy. Well, yeah, because he attaches himself to anything that will give him attention. <laughs> I can relate, which is why I don't want to take what. <laughs> I don't want to date myself. <laughs> it's been a freaking year. I'm just chilling here. Ollie won't get off. Oh, let Ollie stay. Let Ollie stay. He just wants love. Let him get some love. Understandable. <laughs> I literally just laid down to read and sleep. But now I guess I'm lucky. Thank you, Claire. Thank you. I know it's been really quiet on Twitch the last couple days. Kels! Hi, Kels. How are you? I hope you had a great weekend, Kels. I didn't see you on today, so I assume you're going to be off for a couple more days. I know a lot of people are taking this week off. Um, a lot of people have this week off of work as well. But I missed you this morning, Kels. Hanging out here, of course. Hope you're amazing. I'm doing great. I'm doing great, honestly. I'm Like I said, I'm vibing today. Kim! Hi, Kim! Kim, thank you so much. I saw your gift, and I've been trying to find you. <laughs> Thank you for the game, Kim. It caught me off guard. I opened up my email and I was like, wait, what? <laughs> Why did she do that? Here's my kid. My kid is not asleep. Hold on. Yeah, they're not asleep. <laughs> they're not asleep. They're going to play for the next hour and a half, most likely. It is what it is at this point. It is what it is. Waylander! How are you, Waylander? Josh, thank you again for the resub. Two freaking years, Josh. 
Two freaking years. How is that point? Oh, this is the last week for those VIP points till next month. So make sure you're getting your points in. Hope everyone has had a great Christmas. Thank you everyone for the hype train as well. Thank you so much. <laughs> Y'all wild. Thank you so much. Welcome in Raiders. Okay, now, now I'm caught up sort of. You know, follow Iron Kill. Iron Kill with the schmexy ass voice. I'm sad because I can't listen in now because he's playing so much Baldur's Gate. <laughs> but if you like Baldur's Gate, go check out go 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 check out Iron. Iron's Iron's making way on that. He's been playing like crazy the last couple days, so he's way farther than I am at this point. Um, but yes, please go check out Iron. Also does Gumpla. Lots of Gumpla. He's good with his hands. <laughs> Know me from someone else's stream. I pop in here and they're usually lurk. Thank you so much, Blackout. Thank you so much for lurking. I really do appreciate that. Well, welcome in. Thank you for, for hanging out. I appreciate it. I hope your weekend went well. I hope you had a great weekend. Hi, Unlucky. How are you, Unlucky? How you doing? How you doing? Thank you, Grimmy. Uh, save scumming galore. See, I'm save scumming, but then it's like, oh, do I cheat and just put the outcomes that I want? <laughs> Or do I just go through it? Cause I've, <laughs> who is that? Kev! General, got you Kev, I got you. Would you like to see the decks Kev? Would you like to see the decks or do you have one that you know you want me to use? And how are you Kev? It's so nice to see you. How's everything going? It's only for free for today. It's only free for today! <laughs> you didn't say that. You just said it was free. There's a little game that, that Josh was playing today. It's about basic computer coding. Oh, then I don't know if I'm gonna enjoy that. <laughs> you know I'm terrible at computer stuff. Josh, well, yeah, Josh, tell everybody what's free. Now you gotta tell everyone. I wish today had been a bank holiday in the US. Do we have one? We have one though, right? It's like in a different time of year. Is it a different time of year? I tripped up the DJ and Queen yesterday. Anyway, how are you? I'm doing great, Unlucky. I'm doing great. Are you talking about Casa? Are you talking about Casa? Casa do be a DJ and Queen. Where's my last oldest deck? These are my decks. Kev, Kev. There's one, two, three, four, or five. Let me know which one you would like. Puzzle, it's about basic. See, I don't know. I don't know if I could figure that out. That's that's not a puzzle. That's just that's just pure chaos difficulty. Gail was constantly trying to get in my husband's pants in his playthrough. No way. See, I'm telling you, I feel like Gail is a cop out. He's a cop out. He's too easy. <laughs> Guess what I did a few days ago? What'd you do, Claire? What'd you do? Kim was super, super Santa. Honestly, Kim was super Santa. Seriously. Thank you so much, Kim. Thank you for level two, level two freaking hype train. Thank you so much. I know, look at the new emotes. I gotta catch up. I think I only have one of them. I think I've only had one. To be fair though, I've been sending gifts more than participating in hype trains. So my money has been, um, going in one direction. <laughs> I'm glad you're doing well, Waylander. So nice to see you. I was here first. Erica, Erica's uh, waving the uh, the first flag. Going away, going away for a week means I'm not in the top VIPs. Aw, it's okay, Waylander. It's okay. It's gonna be there. It's gonna be there for a very long time. There's always next month. <laughs> Me, you want me to pick one for a general? Oddly enough, I want to use the Persona deck. I don't know why, but I guess we're going to go with it. It's hard for me to read, but we'll figure it out. Why is this all weird and janky? Alright, we're going to use Persona. Hope you had a great weekend. Thank you. I did. It was very, very chill. Very, very calm. Um, it was nice. It really was nice. The sun. Okay. It was really nice, honestly. Kim! Five months, Kim! Five month Risa. 
Jacob, we have a whole hand, Kim. We have a whole hand. What are we doing with that hand, Kim? <laughs> Kim, thank you for the resub. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> Free till 10 a.m. tomorrow. Okay. We'll see. I gotta look at it. Get it so Volchi can teach the girl. <laughs> That's true, huh? That's technically true. Bank holidays are pretty much federal holidays. Oh, well, that makes sense if you have the day off. <gasps> no wood! <laughs> no wood, how are you, No wood? How are you, No wood? How was your weekend? This one, this one's actually used left off. Oh my gosh, this deck is the one that's used most, uh, least often, actually, too. Funny enough. So this is perfect. I got Casa of Guard. Been riding that high all day. I love it. I love it, Unlucky. Optimus deck. <laughs> Thank you, Cam. Gem, you are amazing. <laughs> I got to my book goal on time. Ah, you got to your book goal. Congrats, Claire. GG's. 152 bucks. That is freaking insane. I did finish one book. I think I'm at 14 books though. I think I'm at 14 instead of my 15 book goal, but I did read quite a bit this year compared to like the thought of like I was, I didn't think I was going to read very much. So I did read some books. I really did. We'll see. I might get one more done because I'm in the middle of that third book of Bonded by Thorns, the Be uh, Beauty and the Beast retelling. I do enjoy those. I do enjoy those. And I'm already kind of hooked. So we'll see if I can finish that before the end of the year. And then I'll hit my 15 book goal. Amish vampires? <laughs> Bar girl. I heard that conversation, Bar girl. <laughs> I don't know about Amish vampires, though. I mean, I'll do vampires any day, though. Honestly. Yes, happy holidays to everyone. Happy holidays. I hope it was a great one. I know we got New Year's coming up soon. I ordered two... D Little Mac, how are you? I ordered two DAC paintings yesterday. Both are Randall Spangler. Ooh, Randall Spangler has really big paintings. But they're always adorable when I see them. They're always, they're always really great paintings. That's exciting. I hope you get those quickly. Morning Wood? I mean, no. <laughs> Read DM for me. Oop. Who is that? Grammy and her wisdom. Got you. I got you, Grimmy. Who is that? Jeff! <laughs> Thank you for the gift sub to Kev! Thank you for the gift sub to Kev! Hey, Kev, Kev, yes, Jeff! <laughs> Thank you for the gift sub. I appreciate you, Jeff. Glad it was nice and chill. It was! You know, with the amount of, like, not anxiety, but the amount of, like, dilemma and stuff that was coming up with the holidays this year. I'm glad it was chilled the way I wanted to. But yeah, the girls had a nice day. They, they were playing with their gifts all day, so I had a lot of quiet time. <laughs> so all I could ask for these days <laughs> is the quiet time. Uh, Read DM for me and consider dropping current puzzle website. <gasps> what happened? Does it? Does it really? Oh, I we're distracted, were you? <laughs> oh, yeah, no, a bit distracted there. I see you, Black Iron. Sheep. Black <laughs> sheep. Oh, dear. Can't believe you I see like you. That. I see you. I wonder if it's because it's still in, like, um, like, because they're messing with it? Because they've changed so much? Because that's the only site I have. I don't have any other really good site to use otherwise. I don't know. We'll see if they update it, I guess. Just me be doing my best. <laughs> I told her I'd given my girlfriend some gifts for Christmas after pretending to be broke all week. And then she asked what I had gotten her. <laughs> I barely got my 50 books. Let's go, Kim. Let's go. Anything good? What's the favorite book of the year? What's the favorite book of the year for both of you, for Kim and Claire? Captain Casa says pee pee. Hi, Captain Casa. 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 Hi, Captain Casa.
Captain Casa Dildo. If you do not know, me and Casa are gonna be together this weekend and you can come watch us be together. <laughs> We're gonna do um, a kid up this weekend over there in Casa stream. So if you wanna come join in on our, on our little date, you can definitely come and join us. We'll have drinks. <laughs> Come drink with us. It'll be fun. <laughs> not even. It gets worse, Bard Girl. It gets worse. I'm not even trying right now. I'm not even trying. <laughs> Dragon Priestess, how are you? How are you, Brian? Thank you for the shout outs for Casa. Was that me? It might have been me. <laughs> Go follow Casa. We'll be there on Saturday. Okay? We're kidding up the D-Pal for next year. So um, that's the plan. So I have an extra day, even though I didn't stream yesterday. That is the that is the extra day this week. That's not it. This one. Thank you for the hydrate. I'm just gonna be behind all day. It looks like. <laughs> Hi, Dragon Princess. How are you? How are you? How are you? All right. Cool. I'm not missing too much. <laughs> The 18th, 18th and last day of Xmas she gave to me 18 letters of appreciation. <laughs> she made the last 18 days special. Um, actually, you kind of read my mind on that coming up. That's all I'm gonna say. I have something in the works. I have something in the works. You'll find out next year, aka next week. <laughs> um. But yeah, that's that's a thing. That's that's a little bit of a thing. <laughs> I just posted a picture and show on stream. Perfect. We will check them out later. We'll check them out later. Not a clue. I just inhaled books and barely remember past me finishing them. That's fair. That's fair. Ban gem Casa's out for blood today. <laughs> It's in testing. I didn't know. Oh, is it in testing? Is that what it is? Had my share my feelings. She doesn't have to try get out of here. <laughs> Thank you, Gina. I'm gonna get you right now, Kev. I'm gonna get you right now. I promise. I promise. I'm gonna get you right now. And you too, Grimmy. I'm gonna get you right now too. I promise. Gina. Thank you so much. How are you, Gina? How are you? Yeah, I think they're testing on like and like working on it still because they've updated it a lot from like a couple weeks ago when it looked like completely different. So hopefully they fix that. But totally understandable. Shay, how are you, Shay? Remarkably Bright Creatures was good and I love the lore. Oh yeah, I love Lore Olympus. I gotta finish reading it though. I'm I'm like behind. But definitely love Lure Olympus. Right, Bar Girl? Love it. Hi, Shave. I think I might have picked my DP. <gasps> I'm so excited, Kim. I'm so excited. I can't wait to see it. Excuse me, but we adopted Casa, so all the dating needs to be removed <laughs> first by one bug. This is a contract. Oh, Casa, you didn't tell me this. You didn't tell me this. What is a deep pal? Explain for us. No deep pal knowledge. <laughs> that does not comprehend what those deep pal 24 entails. Deep pal is a diamond paint along. <laughs> Let me finish my chocolate. <laughs> this is what happens when you're gone for a couple days. I'm so behind. <laughs> That's a mood. That's 
to move. <laughs> Dear Pal 24, Diamond Paint Along for next year. Casa and I are doing Diamond Paint Along, uh, where you pick a, a spacing diamond painting. Has to be full coverage, has to have a 20 inch side or more, on one side at least, and has to be space theme. Can have 50% of your painting with um, planets, stars, moons, aliens, astronauts, telescopes, anything that pertains to space, your painting must have at least 50% of something of that. And we just diamond paint all year. When you finish your painting by the end of the year, um, or before the end of the year, let us know and you get some goodies. You will get buttons and stickers from Casa and you will get cover minders from me. My artist, my lovely artist has been working on them. If you would love to see a sneak peek, I would go, uh, highly recommend going to check out the lovely Cup of Joe. Yes, Cup of Joe is my artist this year. Um, I love his work and I thought this was a great opportunity. He has worked on a couple, um, one of them on stream already, but there is another one that I think is absolutely adorable. So if you do not follow Cup of Joe, I highly recommend lurking out over there if you'd like a sneak peek of it. Um, but yeah, once he finishes the artwork, I will, I will be able to, to show it off once it comes in. Hi, Mickey, how are you? Spirit animals, your fish, no one? It's the fish, the chaotic spazzy fish. <laughs> All right, this is for Kev. There's our situation. Let me zoom in. Let me zoom in. Hi, Mickey. How are you? How are you, Gina? I got a Kindle holder for Christmas, so in theory, now I've been even faster because I also got a clicker thing. Oh, oh, let's go, Claire. I want one of those. I love that for you. I want one of those. I'm so happy you got one. I've still got 10 more days before I'm allowed to craft again and the nerve still hasn't healed. Fingers still numb. <gasps> 10 more days, Shay. 10 more days. This will, it's going to go by fast. It's going to go by fast. I hope, it, I hope it comes back soon, though. Oh, my gosh. That's rough. I own and pre-ordered Laura Olympus books. <gasps> Kim, I love that. I love that. Yeah, those books are amazing. They're so good. Elsa Beth, how are you? Malore Olympus library library these days because I have two copies of them. The normal edition and the Barnes and Noble. Oh, these are a lot. So we're not going to take these. This is for Kev. Oh, I still, okay. This one wants to stay out. So we're going to take, we're going to keep this one. It fell on the floor. So I'm going to turn it this way. Why does judgment like to come out so much? It's always popping out. Hi, Crafty Tabby. How are you? My brother's friend is borrowing them. And now I'm a library. Heart stars and horseshoes, clovers and blue moons, pots of gold and rainbows, and the red balloons. Chewy! Chewy, 23 months. Thank you for the 23 month resub, Chewy. How are you, Chewy? How you doing? How you doing? How was your weekend? What are cover binders? Cover binders are these. They are the ones with the magnets on the back. So you, you would hold back the plastic on your diamond painting. They are also needle minders if you're a cross stitcher. They hold your needle. That's what cover binders are. <clears throat> they are cover minders for diamond painting because they hold the plastic. But, um, but yeah, they're essentially needle minders that cross stitchers use as well. If not, if you're neither, um, well, I mean, you probably, you, you would have a diamond painting, but, <laughs> but if not, these are also fridge mag magnets in the end as well. So they can definitely be fridge magnets too. 20 inch full cover. Nope. I want it short. The decal is making me want to hurry along with my current diamond painting. Whip! I also want to work on my diamond painting that I have going and I want to open up and kit up a bunch more. <laughs> We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. I got to get down. I almost kitted down today. I was like, should I get down? And I was like, nah, I just knit. <laughs> just knit. I had to choose being an angel or a devil and I chose good. So I had to give one of my top streamers some. Aw, Gina. Thank you for the candy, Gina. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you, Grimmy. Posted my last project and show on stream. Let's go. We'll check it out in a while. We're talking diamond painting? Never mind. Yes, Kev. Diamond painting. The DP. 
The DP, what DP were you thinking about, Kev? Were you a little disappointed there? <laughs> Apparently she wasn't expecting me the chocolates or something. Never. Naughty Gnome, how are you, Naughty Gnome? I know, Mr. Steppies himself. <laughs> Weekend went well, hope yourself and everyone had an amazing Christmas. I did, Chewy, thank you so much. I did, it was a great, calm, quiet weekend for the most part. I don't even know how to kid up. I'll show you, I'll show you. Let me get this reading though, and I can show you, Kim, if you're gonna if you're gonna hang out for a bit, because I know you go to bed kind of early sometimes, uh, but if you're here, I can show you. Like I said, Casa and I are gonna do it on, um, on sa Saturday. <laughs> but I can kind of give you the gist in case you wanna look for something in the meantime. I had to buy my own clicker thing, so it'll be here on Thursday, and then a super fast reading. I need to order one, too. I really need one of those clicker things. Problem with the whips, our flower delivery is only five inches in, and the Minion Love is maybe at 10%. Yeah, you got a while to go on those. Not this early? Is it not too early? Okay, I'm not sure. Is it you, or maybe it's Aurora? I don't remember. I don't remember now. Don't, don't ask me. <laughs> Make a shopping list to build a new PC. Let's go, Naughty Gnome! Let's freaking go, that's exciting. Hans, did you get your hubby that calendar? I did not, <laughs> did not. I might in the future, maybe for Valentine's Day. <laughs> um, There we go. I'm not even paying attention, but this is what it is. All right. Wow, Kev, what's going on? You got some big energy here. Um. But yeah, I probably will get it for Valentine's Day. It just takes so long for him to get stuff. And so if I order from Amazon, it takes like three weeks to get to him. So I wanna make sure I like send like a whole package at all at once. I get up early, but I also go to bed late. Ah, oh, okay, 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 okay. Same. <laughs> all right, Kev, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Is this a six or the seven? It looks like two there. Three, six, it's a seven. Seven of wands. This was in the reverse, right? Seven of wands. Seven of wands. I know what the six is. What's the seven? Ah, it's the high ground. <laughs> Telling you, these cards like to pop up a lot. This is the Anakin Skywalker card and the Obi-Wan Kenobi card. And then this is Judgment. Judgment likes to, to hang out a lot. So for a general reading, um, there's something of a struggle, a struggle to remain like on top. <laughs> struggle to have, to wear the pants in the relationship. Is that what it is? I'm just kidding. It's a struggle to um, maintain your position fighting off all the the things coming at you. It's like, um, you know, you're, you're, you're trying to like stay on top of everything, but everything is just like coming at you so much that it's, it's, it's hard to keep things back. It's hard to keep things in order. It's hard to keep them straight. Um, that's normally kind of the gist of it, but you do have this in the reverse. So it, it, it almost feels like, um, usually I like to read this as almost like giving up, but I don't think it, that's fully it. It doesn't feel like you're giving up on this. I just feel like you're like in too deep. That's my first thought that I want to say is like, if you feel in too deep, like you're drowning. Oh, for some reason I just see a lot of like, yeah, a lot of, that's the word that keeps popping in my head is like drowning. <clears throat> Feels like you're drowning. You're so overwhelmed that you are just like, you're, the struggle is just so difficult. Oh, freaking kids, man. Hold on. Um, 
Yeah, it's 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 very much an overwhelming feeling. And it's giving I maybe that's why I'm thinking of the drowning is cuz it's more of that like the resistance just feels like you don't know what to fight against. You know, like with how water is, right? You're in water when you're drowning and it's hard to like know which way's up. It's hard to know which direction to go. And as much as you feel like you're like fighting and like trying to get somewhere, like you're not going anywhere. These kids, I'm about to. This week is going to be the struggle week with them. I'll tell you that much right now. I think this week is where I start to lose my shit. <laughs> this is their last full week. But they still have... They don't go back till Wednesday. So... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they go back on Wednesday. So... What is today? Today's Tuesday. They got a week. They literally have a week left. Send them here. My kids are already in bed. They're supposed to be in bed. Their bedtime is 7 o'clock. It's 8.45. <laughs> it's 8.45 right now. <laughs> I think I need more. I think I need a drink. Should I go take a break and get a drink? Probably will in a minute. I probably will in a minute. Um, Almost drowned once. Definitely do not suggest. Oh! Oh my gosh, Tiny Stitcher! I'm glad you're okay. I'm glad you're okay. Oh my gosh. My kid reliability goes to bed. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, but yeah, that's what this feels like. The situation, it's I think it's it's very much like I said, it's a general reading, so I think it's just life in general just feels like this big struggle at the moment, and I understand why. I understand why, but it's definitely like, it's like big, big, big struggle. Um, the problem with this is judgment. Judgment is about um, being called, being called to this, being called to do something. It's a major arcana, so this is something that's been going on for a long time, for a while, for a big time of your life here, a big phase. Uh, but it's like... My instant thought is like calling for help. That's not usually how you would read this card, but this card usually has a lot of like people in it. And they're all, they're funny enough, they're all in boats on the water too, which is really interesting. It's like calling for help. If, oh. Yeah, these, see, he's in a boat, but usually in the original card, there's like a bunch of people, they're all naked, but <laughs> there are a bunch of people in boats and they're all like being called to the angel. Um, but for me, I'm getting big, like, I wonder if it's because I'm focused on them like praying. I'm wondering if that's why, but it's, it's, I'm, I want to read it more as like calling for help not either you're not calling for help or you're calling for help and there's no one answering i wonder if that's what it is like calling for the help and there's like no answer back or there's like no answer no one no one is answering the call that you're giving out and it's been like that for a long time i feel like no answer back I don't know why I'm reading it like this, but I'm just going to go with it. I have to learn to, like, trust myself. <laughs> but that's what it feels like. That's what it feels like. I Like I said, I don't know if it's because in this particular card they're praying. But normally they're just up with their hands out like this. They're usually all doing this, like, to the sky, to the angel. But they're praying in this one. So I wonder if that's why. 
I'm thinking of it more as like a help card than anything else. Hmm. What is this? Let me come back to that. Because this is the solution here. This is the... What is this? See, this is why I haven't used this deck much. Because it's hard for me to read which card is which. I don't know what this is. This is the 13? Would this be the... um? This is a court card. Unless. I don't know what it is. Hold on, let me find another one so I can compare. <clears throat> I want to say it's a court card. It doesn't even have words at the, at the, at the bottom. See, because these have just the words. They don't have the number at the top. Interesting. Who is this? I would say it's death. My original thought was that it was death. But I don't think it is. Hold on. Let me see if I can find death, actually. Wheel of Fortune. The Fool. A Page of Cups. Page of Wands, Knight of Wands, is this the King of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, the Hangman, Strength, Queen of Wands, The Lovers, Knight of Cups, uh, Knight of Pentacles, The Emperor, The Tower, Justice, The Hermit, King of Wands, The Chariot, the Magician, the Moon, and this is the King of Swords, uh, Knight of Swords? Oh, this is the Knight of Swords. The other one was the page then. Le Papi, that's the Emperor. <laughs> that's the Emperor. The other one was the Empress then. Um, Queen of Cups? Maybe this is death then. This has to be death. King of Cups. Pentacles. The Sun. Temperance. No, this, that's the Devil. Okay, that's the Devil. This is the High Priestess. Oh, this is the Emperor. I'm all confused now. <laughs> Queen of Pentacles, the world. Yeah, this has to be death then, and the star. Okay, this is death. I didn't say death, right? I didn't say death, right? Get a drink, get a drink, grab the bottle. <laughs> I probably will in a second, honestly. Um, okay, so this has to be death. That's interesting that they didn't write death on here. I gotta remember that. Um, the solution, death, death is transition. Death is a transition. It's out with the old, in with the new. So I'm wondering, 
I'm wondering if as a solution this is saying <sighs> either it's a change of the people you depend on or a change of what you're the where you're going what you're doing um in that kind of sense so like say if it was like if if there was a call for help and no one's answering and say that's like friends family whatever it's like putting those people aside don't like not saying to cut them out it depends who these people are and how you are to them but like if they're not there for you now they're probably not going to be f there for you um moving forward so i feel like this is saying like out with the old and in with new people that you feel like are going that are going to be more reliable and dependable um same thing with um like say if this is just a situation as far as like um like just to be straightforward to give you a better example kev it'd be like say you're at a hospital or something um, it would be like, say the hospital is not doing what they need to be doing. It would be, it would be like finding a new hospital. It would, it kind of gives that kind of vibe, like out with the old in with the new, like find something that's going to help find something that's going to be better suited to what you need, or at least someone who's going to ans give you answers that you've been looking for or the help that you've been seeking. But yeah, this is going to be a big transition though. If this for sure is the devil which i guess we're just gonna read it like that because if that's what it is that's what it is but um it's the devil is uh sorry not the devil the death oh my gosh now i'm mixing everything up death um is also another major arcana so this is gonna be a long-term change this is a, gonna be a long term if you can bring in something new it's gonna be more beneficial <laughs> if you're gonna bring something in new that's more beneficial um it's gonna be a long-term good change in that direction. This isn't something that's gonna be a quick just for now. This is gonna be something that's gonna change like for a long time, for a while. But yeah, that's what it feels like. There's definitely some big, some big drowning right now. And you're not getting the, the help and the answers that you're seeking at the moment. So you gotta, you gotta change it up. You gotta change up the people and places and things. Out with the old that doesn't suit you anymore and bring in something new. Find a new, a new direction, a new, um, a new group, a new place. And that's, that's gonna be the next big, um, that's gonna be the next part of your life for the long run. That's what it feels like actually was on my mind not gonna lie really yeah it's really really strong like like i said knowing knowing what i do know the little bit that i do know like this makes total sense to me as well but yeah if that's what it is it's like you're not gonna get like you've been you've been sitting in this boat for a while it feels like and it's time because this is like i said major arcana so this has been happening for a while and the only way it's going to change is to bring something new in, to go in a new direction. Let's do, yeah, let's do one of these. And then I'll get Grimmy. Let me catch up. <laughs> what did I miss? What did I miss? Kev is, Kev is in deep. Kev's in deep. Deep, deep. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, oh, they reliably go to bed. Nah, not mine. <laughs> Sometimes they do. Don't get me wrong. But with all the like excitement and stuff happening, um, and stuff like that, and I also think because you know they're not at school all day, so they're not getting out a lot of their like mental, mental, physical energy like they normally do. I think that's why they have a lot more energy still at nighttime. So they have just been like awake, awake but we'll get back into it when school starts up. Looks like the night, night of swords. That's what I thought too. That's what I thought too, but it's not. It's the, um, it's death. 
Oh, of course you get a card with a giant piece of crap on it. <laughs> I do not worry about petty bullshit. I show up, I hunt, I eat. <laughs> Your distant ancestors didn't dick around worrying about how good they looked to the rest of the world. They were all hunting animals, battling enemy enemies, and creating empires. They probably smelled like ass and were completely unaware that their, thank you, that their descendants would gel their hair, <laughs> shave their butts, and implant the body parts to impress each other. Quit focusing on the surface and do what needs to be done in the core to survive and advance. The future depends on you. Yeah, that's what it, it's like. Like I said, with like these people or places or whatever that like you're you're trying to get help from, that's kind of what this feels like here. I guess it, I kind of see it as like a little bit of, um, like say if it's like family members, right? And like you're like, oh, like I really want to, you know, I know I like, Say for example like oh they're my mom and i would love you know i need help from my parents like they're my parents why aren't they helping me but it's like you know if they're not going to help it's like going back to what's important for you and you alone like stop, stop trying to make you know the family work because it's not always going to work i don't know i hope that makes sense kev i hope that makes sense and just getting back to what's important for you. The last card is 200% me, not gonna lie. But yeah, I hope it helps Kev or gives a different perspective or anything like that. Thank you for letting me read for you. But I'm glad it resonated. I'm glad it resonated. Sleeping Luna, how are you? How are you doing? Hi, Spells. I saw you kidding up your D-Pal today. I saw you kidding up. Yeah, I like these cards. These cards are from Kiros. Kiros had gifted me these cards, but they just, they're a little difficult to like figure out what they are sometimes. They're not as like straightforward. But I do like them. Thank you for the candy, Arsenic. I know I have a hydrate as well. How are you, Arsenic? How are you? It is a pretty cool deck. It really is. It's just it's just hard to read. Like I have to I have to like study which ones are which, I think. Most of them I can kind of figure out, but like ones like that, like for some reason that's the only card that doesn't have the name on it, which is interesting. But they are really cool. Hi, Imperfect! How are you? Alright, I got Grimmy. Grimmy, are you here? Grimmy! Hi, Duo! How are you, Duo? How was your week going? How was your time off? <laughs> Got you. Busy, busy. Oh, so not a break at all. <laughs> Hi, Polly. How are you, Polly? How are you? How was your week? How was your weekend? No one. Look at you, no one. Hey, if you didn't know, it's a full moon. If you didn't know, why your life is wild and it's a full it's a full moon. Kitted and gritted, just freaking waiting. I love it, spells. Same mindset. Maybe look like a turd a bit in the morning. <laughs> Fair. Fair. I found a subreddit called Hydro Homies? What? What is Hydro homies, this is for Grimmy. 
I'm doing great and perfect. I'm doing real great. My kid's about to drive me insane, but otherwise everything is going really good. <laughs> How am I doing? I'm doing really good. It's been very chill, honestly. It's been it's been a nice, quiet, cozy weekend. A little quiet, more than I would like. Um, especially since a lot of people have been gone this weekend. I actually was not on Twitch a lot of days, funny enough as well, the last couple days. I actually closed Twitch one of the days and I was like, I haven't done this in a long time. This is for Grimmy. You got two. Oh, Grimmy. <laughs> Courage. Courage, Grimmy. It is time to speak out with love. Connect with your heart to transmit your feelings and opinions to others, Grimmy. Grimmy. <laughs> Grimmy. Divinity. It's a good day to connect with your inner wisdom. Find balance by praying, meditating, or connecting with the divine aspects that you that lives within you. Interesting, Grimmy. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> But yeah, I'm sorry it's been so busy for you, Duo. I'm sorry it's been so busy. I was hoping you would get some good rest time in, but that's understandable. Hopefully, hopefully you'll get some some quiet time in soon. Full moon hive! Oh my gosh. So much busy this week. Are you mooning, Grimmy? <laughs> maybe. Maybe. That's why my dog is ravenous and anxious. It understands some of the feelings I've had the last couple days. I'll say that. It's just people posting pics of their water bottles. <laughs> That's so funny. It's a sign, Grimma. It's a sign. <laughs> been lurking, but I haven't been in chats much. Oh, I totally understand. I totally understand that. Yeah, I've had a few friends on, but nothing like... You know, where I want to be like super, super chatty, chatty, chatty. I've just been lurking, but like I said too, like there hasn't been a lot of people on anyways. It's been pretty quiet. It's been pretty freaking quiet. 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 <laughs> oh, I'm knitting today. In case you're wondering. <laughs> We're knitting. I'm making progress. It's going well. This is my first stream in two days. Really, Kim? I watched Heat yesterday. Heat was on for a little bit, so that was nice. Um, like I said, Iron's been on all weekend, but the thing is, is that Iron's doing Baldur's Gate. So I can't watch because of spoilers. So I haven't been able to hang out with Iron. I'm telling you, every time I peeked over, I saw something and I was like, oh, I can't see that. <laughs> I can't see that. It looks so interesting. I can't see it. So I haven't been able to, did I just F this up? This is all knitting. Um, so I haven't been able to hang out with Iron. Um, I'm trying to think. I mean, Pix was on the other day, so I was in and out of Pix's stream when he was on on Christmas day. Um, yeah, so there was a few, but I was mostly hanging out. It's just people posting pics. That is so weird and funny. You said the Q word? What did I say? <laughs> what did I say? What Q word? A sign of what though? I was brave this weekend. You were very brave. I think it's a reminder. And just to trust your inner, your intuition. You got this, Skirmy. You freaking got it. I'm so impressed with you and proud of you. I am so impressed and proud of you. Both. Not gonna lie. Hey, Zed! How are you? I hope you had a great Christmas. I did. Thank you so much. I had a good one. It was quiet. It was quiet. I just kind of hung out. My kids, I stole my kids' Tamagotchi. <laughs> that Santa got them. <laughs> it's asleep right now. It's sleeping. Here, can you see her? It's asleep, see? It's sleeping. <laughs> I haven't named it. I don't know what to name it. But yeah, I stole my kids' Tamagotchi. I also stole my kids' Rubik's Cube from the other day. <laughs> 
<laughs> I also stole one of the Rubik. I stole my youngest's Rubik's Cube and I've been messing with it every other few minutes that I'm sitting here. <laughs> I've never completed one. I know there's a trick to it, but I just don't know what the trick is. I would say I'm, I'm doing well with it, but I don't know. I don't think I am, honestly. <laughs> I don't think I am. But yeah, so I've been stealing all my kids' toys. On it. <laughs> That's basically what my week has been. I don't know. This, yeah, this is me. This is me. I don't even know. So yeah, <laughs> that's what I've been doing. <laughs> Just that one doesn't have stickers. This is like plastic. It's like plastic in there. These don't have the stickers. <laughs> they still make those? Yeah, this is, this is, this is still a thing. This is still a thing. You can find them. They're expensive now too. They're like 20 bucks. Like damn. So my other, my, my oldest took it out and she's like, what is this? And I was like, you have to feed it and stuff. And she's like, I don't want to do that. And then my youngest was like, I don't want to open mine because I don't want to take care of it. It's, it's still in the package. Oh my God. Great. 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 Not repeating the word. Thank you for the hydrate! I had Christmas at my house, then in-laws, then my parents. So I did Christmas from 8 to 5 yesterday. Oh, it was Christmas yesterday. <laughs> it already feels like it was two days ago. I don't know why. Christmas Day is always a really long day. I don't know why, but it's always like the longest day for some reason. Eight to five, yeah, that was a long day yesterday for you, Kim. It's a full moon. Wait, where is it? And you said the keyword? Questionable? <laughs> Quiet? <laughs> oh my gosh. They do. Take it apart? No, I'm not taking it apart. I'm not taking it apart. We got my middle son a Rubik's Cube for Christmas. He's been obsessed. Yeah, my oldest is obsessed with it. She has her own and she plays with hers a lot. So she does, she does play with hers. But my youngest, she didn't touch it. But of course I can't just get one, right? Because then they're gonna fight. <laughs> so I got two. So now I get the other one because she doesn't want to play with it. They removed the cheat codes? Yeah, the, the, the stickers, they're not stickers. It's actually like plastic. But there is apps where it'll scan in the sides and then it'll tell you how to complete it. So they do have apps. There's a trick for it. I just don't know the trick. We should get a Furby. I had a Furby, a Furby when I was younger. I already know how Furbies are. <laughs> Those things are possessed. We're not bringing possessed toys into the house, okay? <laughs> Seen plenty of horror movies to know not to bring in the possessed toys. Then I had to work today. Oh, you had to work? I hate that for you, Kim. I hate it. Oh, I was gonna tell you about the kid up, kid down. Okay, hold on. I was just gonna brief over it. Hold on, let me finish this row. You just reminded me. Hi, Mally. How are you? Nurses and EMTs will hate you now. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It'll be a chaotic day. A chaotic time. <laughs> All right, let me see. Where is my stopper? You need a full day off. You do. Do you have one coming up? Do you have a full day coming up? My hubs looked at the DP and was like, can you make the squares bigger? What? <laughs> bigger? It'll just be more rewarding.
rewarding when you finish a small one and you open up another. Reasons I had one and was done. Fair. No Furby. What about the Megan doll then? They were nice to play with. Megan doll? Do I know what the Megan doll is? I don't know if I know what the Megan doll is. Picked a kit for the D-Pal and another one because pretty. Oh, <gasps> you can get two? Don't kill sheep? What is the Megan doll? What is that? Hi, Mia. How are you, Mia? How are you doing? How's your weekend? Saturday will be a full day. I took a half day on Thursday. <gasps> one more day then. One more day and then a half day. Is a poster set? Ooh, that's a big painting spells. That's a big painting. Weekend is Tuesday. Yeah, wait, I know I'm confused what I said. <laughs> Saturday will be a full day off for Kim, but a half day, half day, half day is on Thursday. So she's essentially got one more day of work and then a half day at least. <laughs> Am I thinking correctly? Probably not. <laughs> My brain's not working. My brain's not working. This is, this is not nothing new. Don't look at my thighs. There we go. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. So what I mean when I say, well, because when you're kidding up, right? You're kidding up, right? Let's put it this way. If I'm kidding up, basically what I do is I take my little storage containers that I'm going to use for my diamond painting, all my colors. I'm going to basically like take the number symbol charts and put them on the containers. Um, if they don't have these, I'll use like a little just basic, I'll use these. I'll just use these little label stickers and I'll just write the number of the color or whatever they use on their charts. Some, some companies have different charts, but I'll write what the, what the color is and I'll put them on the containers or the baggies, whatever you're gonna use, right? Um, because when you open them normally, the, the bags that they come in, most of the time, they're gonna come in sealed little packets. So you, the, once you cut them open, you cannot close them again. They're basically open. Uh, some Chinese companies still use um, baggies which is nice and it'll already have everything on there. So sometimes you can work right out the baggies. Um, they kind of look like this. They look like this, where they'll already have like the number on there. I just put like the symbols to help, but they'll already come with stickers on them. So they're kind of nice to work out of like this. Um, but most of the time they're gonna come in baggies that you have to put open. So that's why you want to use some sort of storage that you can open and close for your whole painting. Especially if it's a big one, you're going to want something because you're not going to do one whole color on the whole painting and then use all that color because you're going to have to take off all the plastic and you don't want to do that. <laughs> not on a big painting. You don't want to do that. Um, so once you're done working on your kit, basically what kitting down means is just taking all the diamonds out of your containers and all the labels off so that it's ready to refill. Um, there's always a big question about like, what do you do with your diamonds when you're done diamond painting? Uh, there's a couple different things you can do. Some people do, yes, just throw them away, which is not the best idea because they are so small. They are resin plastic and it can be very, very bad for the environment. It can be really, really bad for the environment. Um, so you can do that. I'm not gonna fight you on it. You can throw, just throw them away, that's fine. But there's a lot of different uses you can do for this. You can pour them all into a jar, create jar art. You can also pour them all into a jar for now. And then some people will use these as like fillers for like amigurumis or any sort of thing that you put stuffing in. Some people will use the leftover diamonds for that. Bean bags, you can definitely do stuff like that. Hacky sacks, you know, you know what I mean. <laughs> um, so some people use that as filling. 
Um, other people will save them. I myself like to save them because I do a lot of diamond painting. So whenever I have a kit, sometimes I do run out of a color or, you know, it just happens. It happens, right? You don't get a color in your kit or you run out before your painting's done. So I like to make sure I have like plenty of extra beads um, and diamonds um, that I can just go to. I have a whole shoe box that I have organized. So I'll just go through and be like, oh, here's the color I need. I have it because I saved it all. Um, other people will save them just for other crafts in general, bedazzling things, um, other types of crafts, things like that. Um, I want to say if there's anything else I've heard people do. So there's a lot of uses for them, honestly. It just depends, like, how you feel and, like, um, if you have a place to, like, store them at and how much you think you're going to get use of. How much diamond painting you do, too, is also another big factor about it. Um, but, yeah, so when I say kit down, it's, like, it's just me, like, for myself, since I save them, I put them in baggies that are labeled in a shoebox. And then I'll, um, I'll remove all the stickers. That's basically what a kit down is. Blink's extra drills at Kim. Wanna look at your thighs? Oh, you gotta pay for that. <laughs> Shh, we'll do it after stream. <laughs> Makes sense, I've only done a small one and a big one that I've never finished. Yeah, so there's different uses. Like I said, it just depends what um, what you think you're gonna get use of out of your after out of the uh, leftovers, because you get quite a bit. This is all leftover diamonds from transparent. This is all leftover. It's quite a few diamonds in there. So if you were to like put these all in a jar together, um, yeah, it would make a good amount for like like I said for filling for something small that you're gonna stuff or whatever. Definitely quite a bit in there. But I've been lazy. I have a couple kits that I haven't kitted down, so they're kind of piling up. I do need to put them away at some point. <laughs> Are the colors consistently numbered, at least within a given company? Yes. If, like, say Diamond Art Club, um, the symbols will change. The symbols will change, so you cannot... You definitely cannot be like, oh, it's the same color. Let me use it in the same container with this, the last sticker. The symbol might change, um, but the numbers themselves for the colors are the same. If anything, there is a dye lot issue that you might run into, and that goes with any company. Uh, there might be a little bit of a dye lot issue, so some might be a little darker or lighter than, than your last project. Um... But a lot of them do use DMC numbers. Diamond Dots does not. Diamond Dots has its own coding system. They are DMC colors. They just don't label them as DMC numbers. They put it like 8001, 8002. Eight, they do it like that. So um, if you're saving those, if you do a lot of Diamond Dots, it would be beneficial. But um, it would be hard to mix them with any other company in that sense. Just give me the, give me the prize. I melted them down for ornaments. Oh, that's really smart, Mia. That's really smart. I haven't heard of doing that before. That's really cool. Hi, Kiros. How are you? Can be, that can get expensive though. Which ones? What's expensive? The thighs? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> Hi, Kiros. How are you? How was your weekend? For Christmas, I got sand, a stand rack for my miniature paint. Oh, let's go. Let's freaking go. I love that. Organization hype? Organization hype? My thighs are very expensive, too. I mean... <laughs> I I would say my thighs are pretty decent, so I'm gonna charge for them. What they're worth. I only have so many assets that are worth 
that are worth the money. I gotta take advantage. <laughs> nice quads. <laughs> My thighs are cheap. Free for all. I I'm good. Finally got my delayed collector edition for my time at Sandrock. You finally got it? Holy cow. Sorry. Holy sheep. <laughs> that took a while. I'm having so hard. <laughs> Hey, I know I don't have a lot of, of, of great assets, but there's a few that I'm pretty proud of. That's what I'll say. Gets estimates and quotes for his pricing. <laughs> I mean, honestly, though, there's a market for anything. There's literally a market for anything. Seriously. Would Volchi care? No, probably not. He probably actually would not care. He's like, if you're making money, make more money. That's all I want you to do. <laughs> I don't think he would care. In all honesty. Suspect Sheepy has great ass. I do. <laughs> it's not been in its best shape. I'll say that. It hasn't been in its best shape. But. The one thing I do got, I do have a little bit of an ass, a little bit, a little bit. <laughs> but that's me though, that's my body shape. Like I carry all my weight in like my hips and my thighs. That's where all my weight goes when I gain weight. Max leg press squat was 350. No way, no it would. In high school? Why did you stop? Why did you stop? He didn't want to pursue? That's crazy. 350? That's freaking wild. I forget what Anna benches um, and squats. I forget. She does quite a bit. What the heck? It doesn't help that they said they would call me when they got it. And I was told absolutely nothing. So on a whim, I stopped by on my way home from work this morning. Oh my gosh. So it's probably been sitting there. It's probably been freaking sitting there. That's so frustrating. Well, I'm glad you have it now. Let's freaking go. Is that a collector's piece or is it something that you're actually opening to use? I don't know. Money. Oh, that's true. I guess you're right. Money is a big factor when it comes to that kind of stuff. That's true. My body believes in even distribution. <laughs> nah, mine is all in my midsection. My legs are our normal small like things and I have little tiny ankles and same with my arms like I have regular size basic arms and like tiny wrists and then all everything up top is is small but then once you get to the mid range that's where everything goes <laughs> like damn it dang it But I also have a short torso, so it's like it makes it difficult to to find clothes that fit really well or flatter my body shape. So I have a, such a short to torso. Ready for the new Porsche tea? My ex-husband is yelling at me for dating his sister. <gasps> what are you doing, Kim? I wish I could see that playthrough. That sounds so epic. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? If your if his sister is into it, his sister's into it. <laughs> Loaded Tonin, thank you for the lurk. I hope you had a wonderful weekend. It's nice to see you. I hope you had a great weekend. Switching to phone while I do some house stuff. Let's go. I hope you get your house stuff done. I feel like I clean and then it's all dirty again in like an hour. It's so frustrating. Story of my life. <clears throat> I 
I remember that moment because there was only <clears throat> so many plates available. So I had to wait for others to be done testing. Three plates on each side and then some. And by then, more than half the class gathered to watch. That is so cool, Notewood. That is so cool. Were you popular in high school, Notewood? Were you popular? It's been opened. I wanted the Penske plush, and this way I can get the plat for it. Ah, oh, I see, I see. That's exciting. My husband calls it my time is horse. <laughs> no freaking way. Does he really say that in the game? <laughs> Does he really say that in the game? Horse. <laughs> That's so great. It's weird because Sandrock is trying to like connect to Portia. Um, so I'm like, is it actually going to connect to Portia or is it just like going to be like a road that you can never go down and it's just, you know, <laughs> I'm curious how that's going to work out in Sandrock because they keep telling, talking about like connecting to Portia and I'm like, are they really going to have Portia in the game or is it just going to be like. Cheer 100. There. <laughs> Namu! Thank you for the biddies! Namu! How are you doing? Oh, where's Brian? Pix underscore there stitch he is. <laughs> was the night before home arsenal in Josh Darko's hood. Not a female was stirring, cause they were chained up so it was all good. The whips, <laughs> toys, and restraints were all hung on the wall. You'd swear you were in kink Disney and out at his hey ball. Janet and Veronica were ball gagged and snug in the back. They're still in the bedroom cause Josh left them for a snack. But Hero passed passed out and Josh fell asleep on the couch. Nah. So the laugh. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> so the ladies left him there and went back to Janet's instead. Ouch! <laughs> Oh, Josh, 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 Josh. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm doing good. Hi, Pix. Hi, hi. How are you? Are you ready for... Wait, no. Today's Tuesday. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. I was going to say tomorrow, but tomorrow's Wednesday. Not Thursday. Not Thursday. Let's freaking go. How was your day, Pix? <laughs> How was the recovery? Did you get some rest? Did you get some rest? How are you, Namu? Doing good? How are you? I'm doing amazing. Kind of lurking, setting up a music corner. Ooh, a music corner? Let's go. Don't let me stop you. I love it. I love it. Thank you so much, Namu. And it's so nice to see you. I'm glad you're doing well. Fox does because I date every- Oh, Fox does! Got it! <laughs> Actual IRL husband! <laughs> I've already seen characters. That's true! I've seen- Well, I only know of one. I only know of one. I don't know if there- If there was another one, I haven't realized. I haven't realized if they are a character or not. But I'm curious. You will it will you will connect, but you can't go. Sandrock was initially going to be an expansion. Oh I see. Man, so they're like hyping it up right now too, which is annoying. So it's gonna like give me the road and then they're gonna be like, sorry, you can't go there. <laughs> you can't go there. There he is. <laughs> Ready to go back to work tomorrow? Yes! Hopefully it's chill. I hope they don't give you a hard time for anything this, this week. It should be chill. You would think so. With like Christmas right here. Like nobody wants to do anything this week. And with um, New Year's around the corner. So hopefully it's just a chill, a chill work day. 
recovered, let's go. Oh, it'll be chill. <laughs> you probably met one of my ex-husbands. Yeah, Mint. He's the only one, though. He's the only one. I don't know if anybody else has popped in. Gives Pix a hard time. Hey, yo. Gem is hard for you, Pix? <laughs> Giving you some hard time. <laughs> Met another one you just didn't realize. Oh, really? Dueling needles! How are you? I hope you had a great weekend. Welcome in. But yeah, there's probably another one and I just didn't realize. You're probably right. Um, I think. I mean, yeah, there's been a few characters that have come in and gone. But I'm not sure. The games occurred about the same time. Oh, they're really? They really? Oh, same time zone. Or time, time frame. Oops. time is it? 9.30? I should check the Discord and make sure it's not a lot to go through. So we're gonna go through Discord today. That was another reason too. I didn't want to fall super crazy behind on Discord the way I was last week. So I was hope that's why I, I did crafts today instead of Baldur's Gate too was so that I can make sure I catch up on like weekend stuff. So I can chill out the rest of the week with Baldur's Gate. I finished my Pixel Starlight. Just weaving in the ads. Let's go, Dueling. Let's go. <gasps> is there a lot of ends to weave in? Or is it just a couple? Basically what Kim is saying. If you met anyone from Portia, they're Kim's ex. <laughs> Good to know. Good to know. Don't mention Kim's name. Got it? <laughs> I finished. Wait, wait, I saw that. Hi, Alex. How are you, Alex? I'm just here to lurk and puzzle. Thank you so much for the lurk. I appreciate it. Enjoy the puzzle. Actually, let me check on it. Make sure there's still stuff's going. Oh, yeah, it's got plenty. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. And one other thing about the leg press, literally, or about halfway up, I made a contact with a girl in my class, and I did not like her. With it natural to breathe and even yell during a press like that, I wish I had gone, don't look at me or something. <gasps> you mean, oh, eye contact. I made eye contact with a girl in my class, and I did not like her. So you didn't want her to be the like to think that that like you were you were eyeing her while you were like pressing up your all the weight. <laughs> is that what it is? <laughs> Don't look at me. Imagine, imagine. That's too funny. Why didn't you like her? Why didn't you like her, Noah? I want to know the tea. <laughs> It had to happen. Lots of ends. It is a stranded weight. Oh, uh, stranded sweater. Stranded sweater. I don't know if I know what that is. I'm sure if I see it, I'll know. Lots of ends though. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. Hopefully that doesn't take too long. My fault. So I'm finally dating Ginger. I made eye contact. <laughs> <laughs> I would say <laughs> I mean Yeah, it's happened before where like I accidentally gave a mixed signal to someone I didn't want to give a mixed signal to. <laughs> it happens, you know. I just don't like the shit it was weight class so certain person oh, I see. I see. That's so funny. 
Well, you probably never saw them again, so it's all right. <laughs> it's all right. Oh, Fair Isle! I got you. I got you. Oh, yeah. So if it's something super detailed, it's definitely going to um, have a ton of strands to weave in. You've got this, Dueling. You've got it. <laughs> Don't give up. You've got it. I just... Oh, uh, wait, wait. Deep Hell is ordered! Let's go, Kim! I'm so excited for you. I'm so excited to see what you picked. Now we just have to get Jem to get his diamond painting. That's the next step. And then after that, we have to get um, Duo to also get his diamond painting for the Deep Hell. <laughs> Everyone's going to do DP eventually. We're going to get you all. Believe, believe me. Jem is getting his D. Yes! He said he was. He said he was going to. Better not be lying. I'm sorting through like 15 different ones. <laughs> See, he's licking. He's licking. Sleeping Beauty, how are you? How was your weekend? How was your weekend? How did it go? How are you? I don't know if Queen wants me DPing. Why? Why, do a Why? <laughs> I went down a rabbit hole and I keep getting deeper. <laughs> There's a lot. There's a lot of diamond paintings out there. And it's getting more and more every day. Why do you think I have like a big old stash now? Because I couldn't stop. <laughs> At one point I couldn't stop and now I'm like drowning in it. But that's why I want to like kit down so I can like kit up a bunch of them. I don't know. I just want to, I want to have some ready. <laughs> I just want to have a bunch of diamond paintings ready to go. I don't know why. I keep finding really cool ones that are huge. Yeah. Well, because here's the thing, right? Here's the thing. Depending on the image that you pick, if you're picking something that has like a lot of detail, a lot of detail, you're going to want a bigger size. Because if you pick something small, it's not going to be like, a lot of the times it's going to be something you're going to have to start stand far away from to like see a clear picture of it. Um... So for example, like with Diamond Art Club, that's another thing I love about them is because they make, even though they, they pick the right size that the image needs to be to have the detail, you don't have to stand up close to see what the, oh, Pom Pon Rennie. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. How are you? Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much beep, for hanging out. Beep, I'm a beep, beep, I'm a um, but yeah, with Darman Art Club, they they do it so like they pick the right size so you don't have to stand up close to see a clear picture of it. Um and some companies, yeah, it, they'll 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 not make it the right size. You'll just kind of pick the size that you want, but if it's not big enough, you're it's going to be hard to see like what things are without like stepping back a certain distance. Um So depending where you're looking, yeah, they they might be if you're looking at a reputa reputable 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 <laughs> a reputable company um they're going to pick a a the a size that's going to be good for the image that you're doing. And like I said, if it has a l quite a bit of detail, it's going to be a bigger a bigger painting. If it has a lot of color blocking, you'll usually find like the smaller paintings with like a lot of color blocking. Or it's just giant chunks of color. I'm all right. The weekend was okay. We took Christmas to my mom in the hospital. Oh, that's so sweet. Who is that? Spells! Spells, you were still streaming? I didn't even realize. There you are. How was the rest of your stream? How was the rest of your stream? 
stream. What did you do after you finished kidding up? What did you do after you finished kidding up today? How did it go? Welcome in, Raiders! I did a hundred stitches. Oh, you did Pokemon today! Let's go! Let's go. I was gonna say... I love that. Welcome in, Raiders. Hello! I'm Ariana. You can call me Ari. Black Sheep, Sheepy. I'm a variety streamer. I mostly do crafts. All kinds of crafts! Sometimes I game. We're going through Baldur's Gate right now, so it's gonna be a big focus again for this week. <laughs> um... Also at Baldur's Gate this week, uh, I may not be streaming it to YouTube this week so we can put on the nudity and the jiggle mechanics. <laughs> so let's hope we find the smut this week, yes? <laughs> yes? Yes? Anybody down? Anybody down for that? Um, gives you chaos, lodge noises, dance parties, jump scares, degeneracy, and enablement. Welcome in everyone. If you do not follow Spells, Spells usually um, does a lot of crafts on stream. Um, diamond painting, uh, cross stitch, super chill streams. Go check them out. But thank you so much, Spells. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. Thank you, Arsenic. Thank you for the raid. Welcome in, everyone. Correct your posture. Thank you. I am. Um, I'm knitting today. I'm working on this sweater scarf. And this is what I have so far. It's getting there. I'm I'm ready for it to have more length on it so I can um, try it on a little better. But I like it so far. Size matters. Size does matter. <laughs> Size actually matters. <laughs> Um, okay, I didn't miss too much. But yes, if you have to do after stream stuff spells, don't let me stop you, okay? Don't let me stop you. Do what you gotta do. I will be here. We're gonna go through Discord, so if you have an That's update... That's a mood. That's a mood. <laughs> if you have an update picture, uh, I would love to see it. Let me know if you drop an update picture. But yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna go through Discord in a little bit. But we're just hanging out today. So I've been gone for a few days. I have a few, shoot, what did it say? I have a few steampunk things, well, themed ones on standby, and I can't read. <laughs> on standby? Ooh, I wanna see your steampunk ones. There's a new painting today that got released from DAC, and it's a cat dressed up in steampunk, and it's called Cat Steampunk, or it's Steampunk Cat Daddy. That's what it's called, Steampunk Cat Daddy, and I thought it was hilarious. I got- <gasps> You got two from DAC, Kim? Uh, just know you're not gonna look back at any other company after- after Diamond Art Club. I'm just letting you know now. Once you st once you get Diamond Art Club, you never leave Diamond Art Club. <laughs> you never leave. Vanilla ice cream cake stream. I have a custard cake actually in my a chocolate fudge custard cake in my in my fridge right now. That sounds really good. I would love to get a slice. I will after stream. You're talking about cake and it's making me hungry. I have to be up very very early. Good night, Grimmy. Have a wonderful sleep. Count all the sheep. I will see you soon. Okay. Have a good day tomorrow. Have a good day. I gotta sit up. Progress streams, if you will, most days. Most days. Lots of update on it. Perfect. Post it. Okay, let me see. I sent that one to Jem. Did you send that to Jem? I was going to, but I wasn't sure how Jem felt about cats. <laughs> I was going to. But I was like, I don't know if Jem's a cat person. But yeah, it was really funny when I saw the name. With the cat daddy. There it is. I found it. I found it. There we go. This is Spell's progress on this Pokemon piece. This thing is just coming along so nicely. 
This is coming along so nicely. It's like, I don't see it for a minute and then a bunch of Pokemon pop up. You really have done so much work on this since I've like seen your first like progress pick. Look at that, that thing is insane. It's great, this thing is great. 47,000 stitches done in seven months. That is wild. And here I'm trying to get like something done. <laughs> At least something done in seven months. Something I can say I did. No, this is great spells. Beautiful work. I have to finish the other ones I have. Oh, you have other ones, Kim? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Yeah, you're never going to look back after that. Just know once you get to DAC, it's going to be amazing. Once you go DAC, you ain't ever going back. I'm impressed with Paint with Diamond's website. I got three ABs and the Pillars of Creation. Is that the original Paint with Diamond's? Because I know there was controversy with one of the sites. There was like a, a paint with diamonds that was like a scamming site, but I don't remember if, if that was um, something else, a different name that I'm thinking of. But that's cool, they have ABs? I like that. That's really good then. Maybe it was, that's the better one. Cause there was like a bad one and, a, and an okay one. I'm a cat mother. You have cats, Kip? Did I not know this? I didn't know you had cats. Or a cat? Yes, cats. I like put <laughs> cats. <laughs> but are you a cat person? Are you a cat person? Three of our kids have gotten diamond painting stuff this month. My youngest had me help him work on his little Pikachu tonight. Oh, I love that. Yeah, my, my oldest will pick it up every once in a while. Oh, who is that? Iron! I got you, Iron. Yeah, she'll pick it up every once in a while, but she doesn't have a lot of patience, so... She kind of goes through a little phase with it where she'll work on it for like two days or something, and then she doesn't touch it again for a while. All that's left is... New under Eevee and Vaporeon Jolteon. Oh, so over here. Right? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait. you were distracted, <laughs> were you? Ariana was yes, distracted there. Bad girl sheep, bad girl sheep. Oh dear. Can't believe you forgot like that. I'm always distracted. Always. Eevee, Eevee. Where? Oh, Eevee's over here. Oh, Vintage! <laughs> vintage! Spells and pastels, says right off Limonert. <laughs> Hello, Raiders! Welcome in! Oh my gosh, Vintage! How was your DP today? Let's go! I had you tapped! There we go. Oh, let's go. <laughs> Thank you, Toya. <laughs> How was your stream? How was vintage was diamond painting today? We we're talking about diamond painting. Thank you for the candy. Um, yeah, vintage vintage was diamond painting on her big octopus today. <laughs> How was your stream? How was your stream? How was the progress? Welcome in, Raiders. Hi, I'm Mariana. You can call me Ari, Black Sheep, Sheepy. I'm a variety streamer. I mostly do crafts. All kinds of crafts. Uh, but right now, we're really focusing on Baldur's Gate for smut. Lots and lots of smut. I will be turning off the clothes uh, element, so we will have nudity available. <laughs> if you'd love to come watch, there is jiggle mechanics. I will say this. Otherwise, chaos, loud noises, dance parties, jump scares, degeneracy, and enablement. Welcome in, everyone. Welcome in. Let me say hello. Uh, literal, 
Wait, 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 wait. Literatarian. Did I say that right? Welcome in. Welcome in, Crafting Sam. Cat, I see you both. Hello. Mindy, hello, Mindy. Welcome in. Hold on, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Uh, Vivia Lane? Let me know if I'm saying that correctly. Welcome in. Thank you so much for coming with the raid. Zakayla. Hi, Zakayla. How are you? How are you? How are you? Welcome in. And thank you so much for the follows. Thank you. Is it Vivia Lane? And Literatarian. Literate Ian. Literate Ian. Vivi is good. Okay. Vivi. Vivi, Vivi, and literate Ian. Can I call you Ian? Is that okay if I call you Ian? I'm gonna get tongue-tied if I say literate. <laughs> I already know it. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follows. Welcome in, everyone. If you did not follow Vintage, Vintage is also another Mocha Loco. So we know how we love our Mocha Locos here. <laughs> We love our Mocha Locos here. Um, does a lot of different crafts as well. A lot of sewing, a lot of diamond painting, a lot of cross stitch, a lot of community games, super chill, fun streams. Also dabbles in the tarot. We're doing an affirmation. I was in the middle of an affirmation right now, but I do have a tarot redeem, so you might see that every once in a while. But welcome in, I'm knitting today. I'm working on this sweater scarf, exclamation point sweat if you would like the pattern. <laughs> but this is my, what I have so far. That's what I have, that's what I'm working on. But we're distracted, so. It is what it is, welcome in. Thank you so much, Vintage. Ian is a sweet bean, ooh, Ian, you're very sweet. I hope I don't uh, corrupt you, I'm sorry. <laughs> Ian's fine, okay. I may or may not corrupt you, I will not confirm. <laughs> Do I have there? This one is actually an affirmation deck, or I use it as an affirmation deck. It is Animal Spirit. But I got a couple decks that I use. This is just the basic one. Going in swinging. If you would like to come watch. Yes. <laughs> the number is at 82 because I know you're I know you have one more week I'm curious how much you're gonna get done in this last week Zakayla does a bajillion projects on stream um and 82 that number is how many finishes Zakayla has had this year and I don't even think it's accurate <laughs> as in there's probably more there's probably more Freaking Zakayla, how are you? I adore you. I adore you too, Vintage. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate you bringing the friends. Thank you so much. If you have progress picks, I wanna see a progress pick. But if not, if you need to do after stream stuff, don't let me stop you too. I'm gonna be here for a bit. We're gonna go through Discord and check out what everybody's been working on. Um, so if you would like, if you have something you've been working on, I do have a show, and t uh, show on stream uh, channel. So you can throw stuff in there if you want us to check it out. A2. I know! Zakayla is wild. I don't think it's 100% accurate either. Doing good here. How are you? I'm doing so good. I hope everyone had a great weekend. I hope everyone had a great weekend. It was very quiet, very chill. And, um... Yeah, a little weird. A little weird. <laughs> Not gonna lie, there wasn't a lot of people around. So it was kind of like... All right, now what do I do? <laughs> what do I do in my life? But it's it's been good. It was a good weekend. Uh, my kids played all day on Christmas Day, so I got a lot of quiet time on, on Christmas. Um, or not quiet time, but I got a lot of like downtime, I guess you could say. They weren't they weren't bugging me too much. Um, but yeah, it was a great weekend. It was a great weekend. He does little short sessions because he's autistic and his severe ADHD. I'm glad it keeps his interest. Oh, with the diamond painting? I love that. I love that he's keeping at it. 
Like I said, mine will pick it up, but it's like, it's like very like far and in between. And she'll only do it for like a couple days and then she won't touch it for a while. All right, this is for iron. I'm curious what's gonna come out for iron today. Something different, something normal that's gonna tell him to bring his walls down. <laughs> To open up and be more less or uh, more more emotional and in touch with his feelings. <laughs> all right, all right. Let me see for iron. This one. Fish. <laughs> fish iron. Fish. Water. This is definitely. <laughs> this is definitely something about your emotions telling you never fails with you fish 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 here it is <laughs> reminds me of red dwarf fish red dwarf what is red dwarf the door remains closed well this is probably why you're getting fish iron <laughs> restlessness rest restlessness Change of focus, lost in the current. <laughs> the fish loves to be sub subsumed in life's current. Nothing pleases it more than movement, movement, and more movement. The roaming lifestyle of the fish may be exhilarating for a while, but usually leads to wariness and slippery relationships. With all the possibilities out there in the vast waters, the fish becomes lost without clear goals and intentions. Spend some time with their lunar focus forces, dear fish, as the peace and calm of the moon will soothe your soul. Well, that's interesting because it's a full moon. <laughs> it's a full moon. When it's in balance, adapt and travels well. When it's out of balance, distracted, changes mind often. To bring it into balance, set a small goal and accomplish it. Interesting, Iron. Interesting. Red Dwarf is amazing? What is Red Dwarf? Hi, Doc! How are you? It's a British TV show. Oh! An old British sci-fi comedy. Super ridiculous. I've never heard of that. Sounds like I should save scum more if Walter's came <laughs> Yes. <laughs> there you go, Iron. There you go. Tell you the same thing in a different way. <laughs> oh, that's the wrong side. Pocket Roddy, how are you? Pocket Roddy, how are you? I leave to take care of puppers and come back to Shimi. How are you, Pocket Roddy? How you doing? It's so nice to see you. Did you have a good weekend? Time is it? I guess we should go through Discord, huh? Should we do that? I'm just chatting anyways. What does it matter? <laughs> Might as well chat with uh while we catch up on <laughs> and don't fall too far behind. Let me find where we were at. We saw that. I think we're here with Cub. Funny enough, this kind of looks like a fish too. At first glance, it kind of looks like a fish. Jose, oh, DP progress. Let me see, let me see that first. Let me see that first. Right here, oh, right here, look. <gasps> you are almost done with this? Are you almost done with this? No, I can't tell. I can't tell, oh, no, 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 you have like, Oh, I see. It's over here. It's in this corner. Just that side. <gasps> Look how gorgeous this is. I'm telling you, this painting is beautiful. The colors just pop. I know it's a lot of blue, too, and a lot of, um, like, oranges and yellows, but, like, the color combo together is just so stunning. I know they're, like, what do you call them? Complementary colors, but, like... I don't know, it just does something with this color combo. Yeah, look, you got a little bit more over here. Not too bad. 
But you're almost done with this whole section. I think that I think you said that this was a giant painting too. I believe this is a really big painting as well. Yeah, look at all the blues. So pretty. I want this one. Had a good weekend. I'm glad. You seem like you're doing it. I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Honestly, I'm doing great. Like, I mean, yeah, we all have our, like, moments and days and, like, yes, we want to chuck our kids out the house <laughs> when they're three years old. <laughs> but everything is going well. Going as well as it can be, honestly. <laughs> so pretty, right? Water is great. The water is great. It's like 39 by... Oh, yeah, that's massive. 39 by 26? That's a huge painting. But yeah, this one's on my wish list. I don't know if they still have it available, actually, now that I think about it. I wonder if they still have it available. I can understand. <laughs> They have one more week on winter break. They have one week of winter break left. I may or may not be losing it this week. You'll find out by Friday. <laughs> You'll find out by Friday. Come back and check in on me and see how I'm acting. <laughs> we'll know by Friday for sure. But uh, other than that, everything's been on. Honestly, it's been it's been awesome. It's been good. <laughs> I want to see if I can find my starry night drills. Oh, you had, was it like leftover? Or did you have a painting that you were still working on? Because I know you said you had two that you still had to finish. Beautiful vintage. I'm telling you, I love seeing you work on this. Every time you have it out, I'm like, I'm always watching because it's like, I mean, I'm always lurking anyways, but I like seeing your progress on this one. It's very, um, Satisfying, satisfying is not the word. It's um, visually pleasing. <laughs> visually pleasing, is that what I want to say? <laughs> yes, yes, that's what I want to say. Visually pleasing to watch. <laughs> Thank you, Vintage. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Uh, that is why I stick with dogs. That is my responsibility level. I have two dogs too. <laughs> And they have been attached to my hip. I don't know why. They have both been attached to my hip. Look, look at them right now. Look at them right now. There's one. She's laying against the wall. The other one's right here. Let's see if I can. Oh, I just pulled off my freaking camera. Look. They're out. Hold on, I'm gonna turn on my camera because I gotta screw it back on now. I gotta screw it back on. But yeah, they're out, look at them. Attached to my freaking hit. Freaking dogs, man. All right, hold on, I'm gonna turn this off for a second so I don't make you dizzy. Will I put this back on? Hold please. <laughs> Wait a minute, what did I do? Oh no, it's, it's just got a, oh, it was like a different thing in there? That's interesting. Hold on, I got it. Oh, I need pliers. Oh, I need pliers. Hold please. Where are my pliers? I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. I had a, I thought I was the only one who had streaming <laughs> Oh, 
no. That's that's everybody. Honestly, are you really a streamer if you don't have Tekka shoes? Like, all the time? <laughs> Plus, we are in Mercury Retrograde as well. It is Mercury Retrograde. And this one is about communication because it's in Capricorn. So... Oh, that's not going to go in. It's like crooked. There we go. Oh, you can kind of see what I'm doing. This little piece came out. I don't know how to put it back in. <laughs> it doesn't want to fit. It says nay. But welcome in, Ace. Well, oh, of course my ad it's just started. <laughs> says, dear Mercury retrograde, <laughs> go yourself, get fucked, and out of here. <laughs> With love always, picks. Bags! Bags! It just sucks because Mercury is closest to the sun, right? So it happens. That's why it happens so freaking often is because it's like passing the sun so many or passing around the sun so many freaking times. All right, that's as good as it's gonna get for now. As long as I can screw my camera back on, that's fine. Oh, maybe not. Oh, there we go. I think I got it. Nope, I didn't get it. <laughs> ah! I'm about to just use some tack and just tack this freaking thing. <laughs> Oh my gosh, let me catch up. My dog is out like a light right now. Yeah, mine are both passed out. Well, I woke up, I woke up Ona, but they're passed out. <laughs> I have a Corgi DP. You have a Corgi DP? I only have the, um, the one about the potions. The love potion. That one has the Corgi in it. Little pup loaves. I know, right? Yeah, I'm a big Corgi lover. We are a Corgi family. <laughs> there we go welcome back everyone ace welcome in thank you for hanging out <laughs> thank you for hanging out welcome to the chaos you have potato puffs one of them is a burnt potato i do i really do i need like a hammer like a mallet or something I have one downstairs, but I don't want to go get it. I just need it to stick in there. Do I have anything? All right, let's hope this will just screw on for now. I just need you to screw on for, for now, okay? I'll fix you later. It's kind of crooked, but... <laughs> No, it's not gonna stay. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Moment of truth. That's me. I'm afraid to move it, but it's like too high up. There we go. <laughs> well, you know, you know how this goes. I'm a streamer. <laughs> I'm a streamer. I've been streaming for two years. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Oh, yeah, <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm a bit distracted, huh? Bad girl sheep, bad girl sheep. Oh dear, can't believe you forgot like that. The things I go through for these dogs. <laughs> Thank you for the <laughs> What color green? Got you. Got you. Where's my green? There we go. Is my. Oh my god. My green screen is on for this light. Hold on. <laughs> Let me catch up.
catch up first. I'll fix it right now. Let me catch up. Oh my gosh. Camera down. Camera down. Duct tape. Thank you. <laughs> I would, but I switch it over here for my gaming streams. So tomorrow it's going to get moved. I can't duct tape it right now. <laughs> Flexil will fix it right now. <laughs> Corgi DP is my late Corgi as a puppy. Oh, it's a custom? That was so cute. Flexil, Flexil Gorilla Glue, and good old Elmer's Glue. <laughs> good measure. Hi, Rainbow. How are you? How are you doing, Rainbow? He also spent, also spent uh, Friday till today at the vet, where we boarded him while we were out of town. Oh, was he was he happy to be home? Was he happy to be home? I snuck in a bit of housework. Let's go, AZ. Let's go. Can we see the again? <laughs> so funny, so funny. Okay, hold on. I gotta fix this though. I actually gotta fix this. Um. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. <laughs> I gotta go over here. Geoff? 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 I know you from somewhere. I know your name. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Hold on. How do I turn this off? Why is it? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is it my, um... I have some filter on somewhere. Where do I turn the filters off? Right here. Duh. It's right here in front of me. There we go. <laughs> I fixed it! <laughs> Just... <laughs> what the heck, man? What is going on today? Don't move it. Speaking of moving, have you moved your room? <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Geoff. Welcome in. I think I'm saying that right. Welcome in. Thank you so much. Welcome to the chaos. I appreciate it. <laughs> appreciate it. Know that name too, but I bet it's not the same person. Geoff is Jeff. Is it Jeff? Is that what I'm saying? What I'm saying it wrong? Welcome in, Jeff. Thank you so much for the follow. <laughs> Thank you so much for this is good because this means it'll only be up from here. <laughs> it'll only get the stream will only be better than it is now. Supporting from the two, thank you. You'll only get a better stream from here. That is that is actually good news. <laughs> All right, we're doing Discord, okay? We're doing Discord. Let me find where I was at. Where am I? We're gonna check their Discord, see what everybody's been working on this weekend. Right here, there I, there I am. All right, this is from Crafty Cub. This is from the Crafty Cub. Uh, just a quick thing I whipped up last night. It's a vintage pattern for a shade of lamp pool, uh, or lamp pool cord, but I just made the cord into a loop and it's going to be an ornament to match the tree skirt. Um, Crafty Cub does a lot of, um, did I just move that and it moved my camera with it? <laughs> wow. Um, Crafty Cub does a lot of crochet and things like that. I was doing a lot of granny squares and stuff. So this is a little back to the original stuff that he did. I just whipped this up. I know! I just whipped it up and it's weird because, well not weird, but it's just insane because it's literally every day he streams he has something done to show he is such a quick like crafter he's just like cicala but he does a lot of smaller things in that sense so it's like it's like every stream he has something to show at the that. end it's really cool mom Mammoth, how are you how was your weekend how was your weekend this is really pretty though this is going to be a really nice ornament, especially if it's going with um, the tree skirt. I'm trying to remember if I remember what the tree skirt looks like. 
But yeah, super pretty. Meanwhile, all we all whipping up new starts. I am so ready to have a bunch of new starts this month. I don't know why, but I I feel like I want to start things, but I feel weird starting it now. Like I want to wait till next month for some reason to like start everything. So I might have a lot of new starts next month. We'll see. Uh, was good. Drove down to Vegas for the holidays. Heading home tomorrow. I hope you had a blast in Vegas. Did you do anything wild? Did you do anything wild? My Christmas was great. It was quiet. Excuse me. It was super quiet. And it was nice. It was nice. We made the best of what we what we had, our circumstances. But it was a good one. I want to work on Starry Night. Found everything. Do it, Kim. Do it. Do it. New year, new shit. Maybe that's what it is. I think I'm just weirded out by it because it's like cliche in a sense. But like my mind is like, no, you got to wait till next month. So like there's a cross stitch that I'm trying to pick. I want to start a new cross stitch, but it's more of like a sampler. Um, I don't have any sort of thing like that. Most of them are all full coverage except for my long dog. But that is also mostly a monochromatic thing as well. So not monochromatic. I shouldn't say that. It's just, it's like only so many colors are on it. Um, there's socks that I want to start that I have sew real yarn for. Yeah, there's like, I want, I want to kit up like a ton of different diamond paintings. I'm like, what? I want to wild out because I have such a short list of whips right now. So I feel like, I don't know, I need to start all the things apparently. Post in Discord. Perfect. I feel that. The Nero Spicy needs needs to only start things on a significant number. E.g. well, it's 10.08 now. I guess I can't do this until 11. I'm wanting to finish in 2024. Same. Kim. <laughs> Mood. <laughs> Gumbla, I have to pick one. I don't know what to pick. I haven't seen one that I like. I have looked, but I haven't seen a Gumbla that I'm like, ooh, that looks cool. I want to I wanna work on that. I've seen one, but it was like hella expensive. Like super, super expensive. I picked something else up there. There we go. I'm starting a temperature cross stitch in January. <gasps> Which one are you doing? I was looking, so, okay. All right, real quick. We're gonna go on a little shopping binge for a second. Well, not a shopping binge, but you can, we're, you're gonna you're gonna see what I've been shopping around for. And I just saw this, this, this um, designer has um, temperature charts and they're very different. So I'm curious how it's gonna work because I don't I can't figure out how they how you organize the days or whatever. But look at this. Look at this. Hold on, let me find it. It's loading. Hold on. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Is it this one? No. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I gotta go to my other items. Here we go. Oh, first of all, I wanna make this. First of all. I want to make this. <laughs> this is a story of my life in Baldur's Gate. <laughs> I want to make this, first of all. This is super cute. I would just spice it up. I don't know how yet, but I want to spice it up. Critical failure, exactly. Iron nose. <laughs> Iron That's a mood. <laughs> That's a mood. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> Crafting with care, how are you? Um, so I want to do this one. This is probably going to be a new start. And then let me find the other designer. Hold on. Where is it? 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 It's here somewhere. Ah, here it is. Here it is. Okay. Let me go to there. So they have a lot of like very intricate um, patterns. So like to give you an example, they have like this one, this one's called um, Rainbow Garden. 
But you see, it's, it's hard to see, I know, but it's like skulls and like little flowers. And they have a lot of things like this where they're just like um, super detailed, like patterned out like this. They're very, very pretty. And then um, I, I just saw today that they had temperature charts. Here's a temperature chart. They have this one. This one's called fungi temperature. So it's got like mushrooms that like keep track of it. But I don't know how the colors work, but I thought this was really different and interesting for a temperature chart. But yeah, it's a full like thing like this. I like the designer. You know which one this is vintage? Here, I'm gonna put the link to their um, to this Etsy in case anybody is curious. They have a lot of really cute ones though. Um, they kind of remind me a little bit of, what is it? Foxy Gloss? Glossy Foxy or whichever one that was? It kind of reminds me of them a little bit with their patterns, but it's like different. Like the same, but different. They have this one, look at this. This is Horror Museum. It's a bunch of little frames of like horror movies. Very cute. What gunplay did you see? I don't remember. I, <laughs> I don't remember. I just remember looking at it and being like, oh, that's expensive. <laughs> I, kept going. I kept going. I'd have to go look again. I'd have to browse through. Mushrooms, get it for Heather. This is like, oh, I guess I could. I could gift it. How much was it? I don't know. It was a couple hundred. It was at least a hundred dollars. Oh, no, it was definitely more than a hundred. I want to say it was like a hundred fifty to two hundred. This is what I'm doing. Let me see this. Bring this back over here. Oh, you're doing this one. This one is also one that I've seen not too long ago. This one's cool. I like this one. Some passengers are hey! because of the heat. Heat-seeking moisture missile. <laughs> hi, hi. How is he at thieves? Are you still playing? Are you still playing? This one is so cute. Get out of here. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> was it white and pink by any chance? I think I saw that one, but I'm not a pink fan, so I don't think it was pink. I don't think it was pink. But I think I remember seeing a pink one. Still playing, but I heard mushrooms in my name! Yeah, we were. there's this designer that has a lot of really cool like mushroom cross-stitches, but they're like super intricate. And so Iron was saying to show you. They got little ghosties and stuff too. This is cute though, Vintage. I've seen this one and I, I have this on my, my wish list too, I think, I believe. But yeah, this one's gonna be really cool. I can't wait to see you work on this. With all the potions and stuff. I think I have, do I have this designer saved? I have the shop saved. I have the shop saved. This is one that he actually sent to me at some point. They have a lot of like tarot and like mini, um, like mini images in like a set, which is really cool. Here, I, probably, I can show all this. But they're like mini images and sets. They're really, really cool. They have a tarot set here. I have that one saved. <laughs> but yeah, this designer is really cool too. I do have that one saved. Um, but I was saying this one. They Look at this. Look at this. Look how cute. I, I was thinking maybe doing this one with the ghost and the chandelier. I'm telling you. I'm like super like I want to do all the things and start all the things. But... I don't know which ones yet. I have to figure it out. Oh look, it's the fire bobs. <laughs> the fire bobs are out. And it tripled. The temperature bookcase is a really nice idea. My wife started a temperature scarf a couple years ago, but in my mind, the yarn she chose didn't have enough temperature gradients. I see. Yeah, a lot of the time, the temperature charts, you can kind of like go through and choose your own. Which I would recommend 
even if they give you like suggested like lay out your colors and really see like okay which colors are too close together and can i pick a different like like a darker or lighter you know variation that will show a little more um definitely why does it want to do that no it, it, no it doesn't want to sit right for some reason it doesn't want to sit sit right Sheepy, I've come to the realization. What, unlucky? What? What? But yeah, there, there you go. There's your enablement for today. Despite what I believed all my life, I must have some attractive quality. I mean, I would definitely already assume that. <laughs> but why do you now realize it? <laughs> There you go, Notewood. The giant, the giant fire bomb. That's perfect. <laughs> Why did you just assume now? What was it? What was it that clicked? Unlucky. Excuse me, I've never seen you before, but I bet you're beautiful like everyone else here. Right? That's what I'm saying. Unlucky, I am sure you are like your own worst critic. My reasoning being that the most wonderful and beautiful person I've ever seen willingly dates me and I don't have any money, so it must be genuine attraction. <laughs> that is definitely genuine attraction. That is definitely genuine attraction. Get out of here, unlucky. You gotta change your name, yo. <laughs> you gotta change your name. I mean, though, too, like, I don't know. Maybe they know about your secret inheritance you haven't got. <laughs> Out of that, or uh, it's like Volchi likes to say, you got a big dick. <laughs> or bobs or whatever you have. <laughs> it's got to be something like that, too. <laughs> I love that though. I'm glad you came to that realization. I haven't advertised <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you know how to use it. I don't know. <laughs> but I love that. I love that for you. I'm glad you came to that realization. I'm glad you did. You deserve it. You deserve to feel good about you being you. <laughs> All right, we're moving on. Cub, you're amazing. We know this. <laughs> we know. Also a mocha loco. Cub is also a mocha loco. Um, here's the list for the mocos. If you want to check out who else is on my team, um, there's a list there, and you can go through and see who else, like, what other amazing creators are on there. There's gamers, too. Don't get me wrong, but... There's a lot of great artists and makers and crafters on this team, and it's growing. It's growing so much. I live in Alaska, so shrinkage is a real thing. <laughs> Tina! Oh my god, Tina, have I not seen you since? I meant to tell you, congrats on the team! I saw that. I saw it was you, Shada, and Heat. We're new team members this past weekend. Not this weekend, but the weekend before. So congrats on that. Welcome to the team. Welcome to the team. I love that for you, Tina. G freaking G's. Didn't realize you live in Alaska. I miss it. You were in Alaska too, Spells. 144 members and growing. It is growing. <laughs> was added one week after applying. Let's freaking go, Tina. Congrats. Congrats. Welcome to the, I'm telling you, amazing creators. Amazing creators. Lived there for 25 years. Oh, born and raised. Are you in a totally different, like opposite climate? <laughs> Shrinkage in Alaska, imagine. <laughs> Oh, you're in Texas. Oh, that's a big change spells. Why would you do that? <laughs> Why would you just yes, yeah, Stitch? I'm sorry. Why would you do that? Why would you leave like extreme cold to go to an extreme heat? <laughs> that's a lot. When we're cheap, ah, that's fair. That's 
That's honestly freaking fair. I can't fight you on that. Oh my god, Josh! <laughs> Josh! Do you need attention? <laughs> Is that what you want? <laughs> give me Corgi <laughs> All right. All right, I'll give you a few minutes of Corgi Cuddle. Come here. Come on. She's like here, like nudging my hand. She's shedding right now, so I'm about to get fur all over me, girl. Girl, oh my god, girl. <sighs> Say hi, Stitchy. Say hi. Say hi. I don't have anything for you up here. Say hi. <laughs> Mona's getting jealous. Say hi. Say hi, puppy. Yes, I know. We haven't done this in a while. I know that you go. We haven't done this in a while. Huh? Give me a little cheeser. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh my god! She's looking at Mona and then cuddling me. Correct your posture. I Oh my god. Like she's looking at Ona. <laughs> you're, so you're too funny. No, you be nice. You be nice. <laughs> you're making her jealous. Okay. I am. <laughs> Well, she was asleep. Sitch was here, like, snuggling my hand. <laughs> no, I know. <laughs> it was cuddling my hand. Oh. Corgi was a 40 pound fudge boy. Yeah, she's heavy. This one, she's like 30. Well, last I checked, she was like 35 pounds, but I wouldn't be surprised if she's like closer to 40. Do you see her fur? Do you see her fur? <laughs> she's shedding a lot right now. I know. I know. You're just big baby. You're just big baby. You're just big baby. Leave on her lawn. Look at all that fur. Do you see all that fur? I'm gonna be covered in fur after this. All right, I'm gonna put you down, okay? Can I put you down? Yes? Okay. Just for you, Josh. I don't even have my lint roller over here. Ugh. Hold on, I need a lint roller. Let me go back. Oops. There we go. Got it. <laughs> Taco glitter. <laughs> it's a lot. Stitch sheds all year. She does not stop shedding. So certain periods of time she sheds more than others, but for the most part, she's like a shedder all year. Ona only sheds twice a year, but it's a lot. Ona woke up real fast when she heard Courtney cuddle. <laughs> she did. <laughs> she honestly did. Can use your hands. What? <laughs> get enough boobs last night. Shake my head. I gave everyone an Xmas present on my stream. <laughs> I don't have a low cut shirt on. And if I were going to do what you do, he, I'd really have to like lean into the camera. <laughs> Mine are too small. <laughs> that would be like literally leaning forward. An oa oa, you mean a boof? Boof? On a boof? Boof. 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 
Imagine not doing that on the big cam. Oh, imagine. Oh, this is what you want? This is what you want? You still can't see. <laughs> I can't move my camera. I broke it. I broke it. My corgi sheds twice a year. January, June, and July, and December. July through December. <laughs> January to June and July. That's exactly Kim. Kim knows. Corgis are honestly amazing dogs. The only downfall is the fact that they shed so freaking much. That is the only downfall. Your legs ain't broke. <laughs> I how did I break it? Cause I pulled on it. So the little the little screw part like popped out of the camera. <laughs> And it's not going back in, so I have to get like a hammer or something and like pound it, you know? <laughs> Gotta pound it back into. <laughs> Chair slides back. Let me see. I don't have anything, Josh. I have not <laughs> Say that again, I like it. I don't have what he has. If I stood up and like lint rolled my ass, that's a different thing. <laughs> Not doing that without getting paid. I'm telling you that right now. <laughs> you gotta pay for that. That's a pay me thing. All right, I think we're good. Cheer 100. <laughs> Kim, thank you for 100 bitties. Cheer 100. What if you can see everything else through there? <laughs> Got dog fur in my mouth. I'm glad my GSDs only shed once a year, May through April. <laughs> May through April. Thank you for the 69 50s. Nah, nah, I see what you all are doing. We'll do it in the Discord, okay? <laughs> Chew 100. <laughs> Thank you for the pennies, Tina. <laughs> Chew 100. <laughs> dog hair in my mouth. What's that? Chat That's summons a mood. the hype train boy. That's a mood. <laughs> and <laughs> all right, hello, all right, how are you? Shouldn't have said nothing. Cheer 100. <laughs> Biggest troll. This is facts. <laughs> Corgo 100. Thank you for the 100. <laughs> Seriously, you gonna make me do this right now? You gonna make me do this? <laughs> is that TOS? <laughs> is it TOS? Is it TOS? To lint roll my ass on stream. <laughs> is that TOS? You need 100. <laughs> I just want to make sure. I want to make sure. I won't get bad for this. It's called art now. <laughs> Should I go into the art channel? Should we go into the art channel? Hey, they have twerking in the art channel. They do have twerking in the art channel. Don't ask me to twerk. I, I actually don't know how to twerk. That's not something I know how to do. <laughs> You've seen the black bars in art lately? <laughs> I don't have a 
bar though. Should I upload a bar? Look at me, be like juice. Oh, here, watch. <laughs> watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this. <laughs> cheer 100, shake it. Chew cheer will 100. channel <laughs> awkward turkey is almost better than professional twerking because it's funny you want me you want me to do it so you can make fun of me is that what you're saying <laughs> i don't know you're getting my shy side right now <laughs> you're getting my shy side i can't do it i can't do it <laughs> Thank you for subscribing, Ian! What are you doing? <laughs> That's what he's saying. Chat's a bunch of trolls. That's exactly what chat is. Ian, thank you so much for subscribing! Thank you so much! I feel like if I do this too, though, you're gonna clip this. <laughs> you're gonna clip it and make it an emote. Why do I feel like that's gonna happen? <laughs> today if i didn't have light color pants on i probably would but i don't know if i can do it why do i like clip things i don't know <laughs> you're making me so conscious i'm getting so conscious you guys are too much now i'm gonna get giggly remember how i get nervous this is when I get giggly. Sleeping Beauty! Thank you for the biddies. I'm getting nervous, you guys. I would love to do it for you. I would love to do that for you. But I'm getting really shy. I'm getting really shy. That's why you just gotta stand up and you'll giggle and the booty will jiggle. It's not that big. Thank you for the lurk, no one. I know you have to be so kind. I will. <laughs> I am <laughs> so conscious. You're making me nervous. You laugh hard though. I do, but it's all up here. It's not down here. <laughs> My ass doesn't shake when I laugh. <laughs> Imagine, Minty. Hi, Minty. How are you, Minty? <laughs> How did we get here? How did we get here? How did we get here? Oh Fix no. Fix underscore stitch says in the famous words of Sean Paul. <laughs> shake that ting Miss Canna. Canna shake that ting Miss Annabella shake that ting. <laughs> Yo, Donna, Donna Jody and Rebecca. I hear the puzzle. I hear it's done. I'm with family, but I want to do this with Minty with her family. Thank you, Minty. Thank you for stopping in and saying hi. Sorry we're rubbing the balls free for dog fur. And you said you only I didn't say I would turk for money. I said I would lint roll my ass for money. That's actually what I said. Facts. Facts. I have two different things. Hold on. Who is that? There we go. I hear so much music right now. Oh. I don't know. You all are making me nervous now. <laughs> I don't know if I can do it. So he has for her patience for that mind of yours is divine. Oh my god. 
You're never gonna unsee it. I don't know if this is something you never wanna unsee. <laughs> saw what happened to Gandalf when he met your ass. <laughs> oh my gosh. I, I don't know how to twerk, you guys. I don't know how to do all that. <laughs> I'm not even gonna put myself on the big camera. <laughs> Am I really gonna do this? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm weird. I'm weird. This feels weird. <laughs> I can't do it. 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 I'm sorry. I can't. I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. Thank you for the high trade, though. <laughs> Thank you for the high trade. I appreciate you all. <laughs> I can show off my creamy thighs and hide. <laughs> You have a pick up on your screen. I do. I do. This is Discord because we're doing Discord. Remember? <laughs> Remember that's what we were doing? <laughs> Dance party! Dance party! Dance party! Lotus, welcome in! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I see what you're doing. <laughs> I get it, I get it. Cheer 100. <laughs> Work. That's all you 
all you're ever getting. <laughs> Don't ask for it anymore. <sighs> all right, we're done with stream today. <laughs> I'm gonna rain out. We're raining out. I so much harder to sell my dress. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was nervous. I'm still nervous. To come in and join. Lotus, welcome in. Honestly, we always have chaos here. To be I do crafts. I'm a crafter. I'm a crafter. I'm a crafter. I gotta remember where I'm from here. I'm a crafter. What? 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 Encore. I do any mm -hmm. encore. Get out of here. That's a 10. That's a 10. Thank you for the 69 biddies. Well, I gotta turn on the music. <laughs> your fun. <laughs> Welcome in, Lotus. Thank you for coming in and hanging out. I really appreciate it. Oh my gosh. I don't even want to watch that. That's so cringe. I don't even want to watch it. I'm not watching that. <laughs> if I leave it, imagine that it pops up when people shout, you know, when people shout you out and the eclipse shows up. <laughs> I might delete it. <laughs> Rework for you. Thank you, pals. You know who's a big one with that? Juice. Juice is a big one with the with the, <laughs> the shout out clips. Need a drink, ma'am. Who? Hi, who? How are you? How you been? Hi, wholesome. How are you, wholesome? Hey, is Katie still here? Bold of you to assume I would let you do anything. This is so true. They find out you're a vibe. <laughs> oh, I'm glad she's still here. She came for a nice big trip. How was Christmas? You're back. No worries. I'll be here. <laughs> can't, uh, can't say nothing will happen when you're gone. <laughs> She got a DP set at Michael's? <gasps> I'm so excited for her to try one of those kits. I know she's done smaller ones, so I hope she likes it. Oh, what'd you get it for Christmas? What'd you, get, what'd you get it for Christmas? I currently be hangry? You should eat, who? Go eat something. Go eat something. 
Did you make a romantic proposal over the holiday salsa? It do be cuffing season! Josh, they're already married. <laughs> Josh, did you not know? <laughs> they're already married! They got married over TwitchCon weekend! Books and plushies? Aww, that's so sweet! That's so sweet! I love that. You guys are adorable. You're both adorable. All right, I'm gonna go through Discord, okay? Can I be done with the turkey? <laughs> I don't wanna turk anymore. I don't wanna do that anymore. <laughs> Headed home to eat the closing shift today. Wait, what? Closing shift today had a lot of young hands. And me and the closing manager were a bit frustrated with them not working. Ah, it was one of those days! It's one of those weeks, I feel like, where nobody wants to do anything. I'm sorry it was a long day. Get some food, get some food! Don't pay attention to what I do or don't remember this year, Josh! They've been married! She got me a leather d, &D book. Hey, yo! She got you something made of leather? Is that all? <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> hey, yo, wait, what happened? <laughs> so I can make him a crochet bikini top? What? Picks? Picks! 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 You're gonna get a bikini top? <laughs> I wanna see you in a bikini top. <laughs> Josh, I'm gonna take off. <laughs> Oh, it's upside down. One sheep, two sheep, three sheep. I want cookies. <laughs> it came in! I gotta find the pillow that I have for it though. I gotta find the pillow. It's in the house somewhere. I just gotta look for it. But it came in! Look how cute! Oh, is that the charkini? Or the charkini? Char charkini? Is that the charkini for picks and you so you can do jelly jello wrestling? Is it finally, like, happening? <laughs> Been waiting for, like, over a year. <laughs> Been waiting for over a year. <clears throat> it's a charkini thing. My bracelets have been on the screen. I know, Sleeping Beauty, I know. <laughs> Made some earrings and a couple of bracelets. This is for Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> These are so pretty. They remind me of uh, high school with the puka shells. Yes, I was a puka shell wearer for a while. That was me. Big dicks, daddy picks. <laughs> so good! Lotus is one of the OGs on that meme. Oh, really? Interesting! <clears throat> it's been like two years I posted in his show and tell one time, and Josh said I needed to make one for picks. So it's been his job to get me measurements. Oh! Well, you know, they do be spending the time together, but obviously, like, they get very distracted when they are together, so they, you know, Josh forgets. <laughs> Makes sense. Oh, wow! That's so funny. That's so funny that you've been around that long. Wait for those measurements! <laughs> totally thought it was a pillow, not just a case. I do, I do, I do have a pillow for it. I do have a pillow for it. But yeah. It came in. It's so cute, but it's gonna go right here on my little chair behind me. The top one is Jadeite. Jadeite. Oh, they're actual crystals? Get out of here. This looks like a seashell. <laughs> so of this fish. So we're all up in this fish. So Rose here, so Rose here. And then, oh, look at these! I love these. Ooh, I love these. Need? I need these. Need. That's a better word, need. Holbert, how are you, Holbert? How are you doing? I've been lurking and plundering. <laughs> oh good, you're working, you're working on the, the Sea of Thieves. <laughs> See of these? See of these? 
Good. Uh, you don't. We didn't have any booty over here. You didn't see anything. <laughs> See yes. <laughs> the bottom one is hermatite al abalone shell and glass beads. Oh, on this one, these are beautiful. This this shiny one, these are the um <clears throat> the glass beads. Very very pretty. But yeah, it looks like a seashell. I love this color though. This like minty green, like um, ocean color. It's very pretty. Came into twerking. <laughs> Damn it. Ultimate twerk on championship. <laughs> Just having a craving for cake for some reason. Well, I have cake. I'm gonna go have my cake and eat it too. <laughs> Jumps in a cake delivered to Jeff's store. Hey, y'all! <laughs> These are a beautiful sleeping beauty. I love your jewelry. You've been doing a lot of jewelry lately. It's very, very pretty. I love it. I love everything that I've been seeing you make lately. So pretty. Do you sell? Do you sell sleeping beauty? Do you actually have a shop? <clears throat> I made the bracelets for my kids, but the earrings will go to new homes eventually. Hopefully! Well, if they don't, let me know. <laughs> let me know. If they don't contact you in the next 24 hours, let me know. <laughs> uh, we got who? Finish more Christmas present crafts. Look at all the Hello Kitties. Are these cookies? I can't zoom in. Are these actually macarons? I can't tell. They look like actual cookies. They're very cute. Are these polymer clay? Clay. I bet you these are polymer clay. They're little Hello Kitties. I want to zoom in, but I can't. Can I do it this way? Inspect? Nope, that's not what I want. That's not what I want. Is there a zoom button? There isn't. <laughs> there isn't. I want to zoom in. It's clay. They look like real cookies, who? That is so pretty. Look at this dragon. There's a dragon right here, too. They look like real cookies. You know what's funny? No, I think it switched off. Never mind. I think it switched off. I was gonna say, I think that this, I have to manually take off the Discord on YouTube. And I didn't take it off when I was twerking, so I'm hoping it didn't record or you couldn't see anything on YouTube. <laughs> I don't know though. I do sell, but I'm still setting up my online shop. Oh, well let me know when you have it set up. For my coworkers, that is so sweet. They're very pretty. There's these look really cool. I like these a lot. Here's some jewelry though. No, this yeah, this is earrings. <sighs> With the beautiful purple. I like this color scheme here. With the purples. Ooh, I like this too though. It's very earthy. Earthy tones on this one. I like the earthy tones too. We got uh, Snow White. Jem would love this. <laughs> Jem would love this. <laughs> we got a little suit sprite. Look how cute. Little suit sprite. more here. You get a lot of jewelry done too, who? Oh, these are cute with the slaws. This is cute. And the little fruits on the top. We'll do yes. I would love to know. Oh my god. Homer! <laughs> Why, Homer? Why? There's an ad gonna start. Let me run the ad. <laughs> Let me run the ad. Let's get it over with so we can keep going with Discord. I'm already super behind. Am I going to catch up? I don't know. I mean, I don't have to go to bed right away, technically. I'm stabbing things? Who's stabbing things? Oh, so, so Rose. Oh, yeah. So Rose stabbing things in um, Sea of Thieves. <laughs> I'm gonna sleep real good tonight. I'll tell you that much right now. D 
Do you want a new puzzle? Do you want me to add a new puzzle for the night? Or are you guys puzzled out? Let me know and then I can I can pop one up if you want. Let me know. I can add up another puzzle if you want to puzzle out. <clears throat> Easy sip sip. Water break. I know. I, I need to drink. I do. I, I sh if I was drinking, I probably... <laughs> you probably would have convinced me a lot sooner, to be honest. I had a little bit of wine with dinner, but it wasn't a lot. I would need something stronger than that, honestly. I did get more, um, what is it called? <laughs> grenadine, why do I always forget what grenadine is? Grenadine, I got some more grenadine so I can make my uh, tequila sunrises. Welcome back, Ian, welcome back. All right, let me see here. We got, we got some more from Cub. Oops, let me go over here. But yeah, let me know if you want another puzzle. I can post up another puzzle if you want. Uh, my haul from Christmas. I can't wait to look through the crochet crowd book. These two purple things are jars of that cleaning gel for keyboards or the console of your car. And the thing in the upper middle is the electric card shuffler. Wait a minute. What? Okay, so this is the car cleaning stuff? Interesting. I'm going to have to get some of this cleaning gel for keyboards I'm gonna have to look that up how do you have Girl Scout cookies how do you already have Girl Scout cookies unless those are saved I'm a hooker in my spare time this is a keyboard mug I like the mug that's adorable what is this a card shuffler so it couples it couples it shuffles your cards for you I didn't know that Cub was a big card player. I probably need that for tarot. <laughs> and a Cheesecake Factory gift card. Let's go. I see cheesecake in your future. I'm jelly. Ah, who's up? Look at you, who? Look at your progress. Was this a gift? Was this a gift to somebody? I like the ruffle on one side. I assume this is a scarf. But I like the ruffle. I like the ruffle detail on it. Gotta hit the hay. <laughs> Are you streaming? When do you come back to streaming, Duo? Scarf for my bestie. Oh, did they like it? Did they like it? But yeah, when are you coming back to streaming? Christmas game tomorrow. Oh, okay. What's tomorrow? Tomorrow's Wednesday. Okay. I will keep an eye out for you. Point and click adventure struggle. Perfect. I missed all the friends. I missed all the friends being on. I usually have like my set people at set times. And so it's like been so quiet the last few days. So I'm excited to get back to normal, <laughs> to normal lurking hours. <laughs> all right, duo. I'll see you tomorrow. We speak of nothing about today. You understand? <laughs> we speak about nothing today. Have a wonderful day sleep count all the sheep i'll see you tomorrow i'll see you tomorrow hey go follow the duo where are you go follow the duo <laughs> that's where i'll be lurking tomorrow morning yes oh i'm glad she wore it to the christmas lunch and we went to <gasps> that is so sweet that is so sweet and that sounds like so much fun a christmas luncheon i hope the food was good too but I love that. Congrats on your finish. We got picks, picks. I don't know how you made so much progress on this. It was funny because it was like, oh, we're gonna do DP next. And then it's like, I turned around and I came back and you had all of this like whole black section done. And I was like, how did you do that? You did this very quickly. Excuse me. You did this really, really quickly. I was very much, you were single placings too, no? I didn't see you use a multi-placer. But yeah, it was like you were about to like 
switch your project and then when I came back you had like this whole like chunk done and I wasn't gone very long single placement yeah you were very quick with this also these are adorable these brick heads I love the um the demogorgon the demogorgon is my favorite a new ornament hype I didn't get to see your finish on this I think you were finishing this up I don't remember what you were doing before but I didn't get to see the finish on this I saw you start it. I didn't see it finish. I was like in and out all day. Look at all your progress. Oh my gosh. I'm jelly. <laughs> I don't get anything done. <laughs> but GG's. Single place it worked on more. Are you liking it? Are you liking the bigger size so far? <laughs> Is the bigger size more satisfying? <laughs> Oh, look at your work! I love it! I love it. I love this painting too. This is such a great image as well. Uh, we got Alric. These are from Mama Alric. Uh, diamond painting finishes. Needless to say, I think she likes it. I am so happy that she enjoyed this. That just means you know what to get her for Christmas and birthdays and stuff. Mother's Day as well. More diamond painting kits. But this came out really, really cute too with the little fox. What is this one? I don't think I saw this one last time. With the snowman? This is a partial. This looks like crystals. Which is really nice. They literally look like crystals for the clear ones. That came out really pretty. The little lantern too. Aw, GG's to your mom, Auric. Congrats to your mom for finishing these. And again, I'm so happy she enjoys them. Yeah, they literally look like ice crystals. I'm enjoying it. Bigger is better, eh? More is more, Pix. More is more. Ah, the artboards. Look at your year. 2023 Lego artboards in order of redemption. It's crazy to look back on this and think about each one. 48, 48 total. 12,288 Lego dots. This is insane. How cool to have them like this. Look, here's my first one. My little sheep. I, okay, so I'm thinking I can't do cross stitch, right? I can't do cross stitch this small. I just get bored. <laughs> I get bored. Um, but I'm thinking I would love to use both of these that I redeemed for little pixel blanket throws. So that's what I want to do. It's just a matter of accumulating the yarn, though. I need the yarn. But um, I have the little sheep here. The little sheep with the rainbow. But yeah, look at your whole set. <gasps> this is my new one, look. Do you see her? This is Ona. Do you see Ona? Look how cute she is. Look at her smile. That's literally her. She's asleep right now, but that's her. <laughs> As soon as you showed me this, the, the last image fix, and I saw the smile, I was like, that is Ona. You got her perfectly. She got a big, goofy smile. I see my Octo. Where are you? Right here. This one. <laughs> That's crazy and so cool. Yeah, Pix has this as a redeem. You just have to be really, really quick when they become available, because they go like so fast. As soon as the cooldown is up, it's like they're sniped. So you have to be like waiting. Best chance is to know when Pix is gonna do the, the new artboard. So it's tomorrow, right? Tomorrow people will have a new chance to pick the next ones. Is that how it goes? And um, if you're there, when as soon as Pix goes Thursday, Thursday, I keep thinking tomorrow. I keep thinking today is Wednesday. Um. But on Thursday, if you're there right when the stream starts, you can snipe it real fast if you're quick. And that's probably going to be your best chance. <laughs> it's best chance. Looks amazing, right? And all these patterns are free. So if you want to create these in some form or another, uh, Pix has a, has a link to all of these. I just knit! How are you? Welcome. Look at your little sheep emote. I love it. I'm doing great. How are you doing? How was your weekend? Did you have a great weekend? 
Love her. February redeems are up. Ah, oh, so it's for February. Okay. Good to know. But yeah, that's your best chance. Oh, this unicorn? This is the last unicorn one, no? And this is Casa, I believe. Pirate hat. <laughs> Where's Josh with his eggplant? Here, right here. <laughs> Josh with the eggplant. <laughs> That's cool. I love this. I love this image. This is so fun. Uh, we got Tiny Stitcher. <gasps> Clearing off some bobbins to end out the year. Two ply fractal on the left and three ply on the right. This is really, really nice. Look at your spinning. A lot of people are getting into the yarn spinning or have I've seen a lot more yarn spinning this year. It looks like a blast. This looks so nice. There's like the yellowy brown. And this is more of like the orange golden colors. Very, very pretty. Shay redeemed the last unicorn. That's who it was. <gasps> Who's she for those? Angeli. Their yarn a lot. How cute! Doing good. Got my DP for. J Let's go! I'm so excited. We are doing a kid up stream on Saturday over on Casa's channel. Nope, that's not it. This one. <laughs> I'll be over there on Saturday at 7 p.m. Central. We're gonna kid up. So if anybody wants to come hang out, that's where I'm gonna be. And we'll be drinking. We'll be kidding up our kits for next year for the diamond, uh, the diamond paint along next year. So um, come hang out. Sorry, the the fan is blowing like furs, and I feel like I still have dog fur on my face. Um, yeah, come hang out. Come hang out. Oh, it's Angelic Dreamer. Oh, now it makes sense. Angelic, I see it. Angeli. <laughs> see it and miss the C on that one I hate how short they make those spinning is so much fun I think I've been spinning for 15 years you've been doing it for 15 years I was gonna say like these look so um even not even even it's not the word I want to say not even but um consistent that's the word I want to say they're very consistent all your strands are so consistent very pretty color combos. Do you have do you have projects for these, or are these going like? Do these have a a purpose yet, or are they going in the stash? So pretty though. You did an amazing job on those. <gasps> Little Mac got these. Hold on, let me make sure there's nothing there. Yeah, we're good. Uh, the two paintings. A little bit of magic and trick or treat house. Trick or treat house, I really like. Spells and pastels says we have to wait till Jan first to start the pool, correct? Yes. <laughs> you gotta wait one more week. One more week. And then you can all start. And um, you don't have to start on the first if you don't have a painting yet or anything. You can start whenever you can, whenever you're ready. Um, but yeah, it officially starts on the first. Officially starts on the first. First one is stash. Second is going to maybe be a scarf. Ooh, that's gonna look really, really pretty with the oranges. I like that one. That one was the, the one I liked more. Just because it has the oranges. I like, <laughs> I obviously have a, a love for orange. <laughs> orange, orangey reds, orangey reds. But it looked very fall and I love fall time. So I like that color combo. Um, but yes, yes, the first is when you can start. So that's why we're going to kit up on the 30th and um, have it ready to go so we can also start our paintings at the beginning of the year. I don't think I'll be starting mine till... Uh, it depends what day I decide to do it on. It'll probably be like a consistent day. I want to say Fridays are going to be my depal days. Um, after doing the math, it's like, as long as I do two and a half sections a week, I'll get it done by the end of the year. So that's why I'm thinking Fridays, because I can for sure get progress done on, on, my, on Mondays or Fridays. So Fridays might be depal days in general. 
Um, so that means I won't start mine until the 5th of January. So it'll be at the end of the week. Be right back. No worries, Rainbow. I'll be here. Um, but yeah, it's Trick or Treat House. I like Trick or Treat House. This one's a cute painting. And the little bit of magic. I mean, they're all really cute. But if I were to pick one Randall Spangler, it would have been Trick or Treat House for sure. Here's my whip. <gasps> Elsabeth? Elsabeth! No, you didn't. I can't. I can't. <laughs> um, does Pix know about this? Does Pix know about this? Ah, oh, you can't see it. It's so small. It's so small. <laughs> if you can't see that, you need to go to the Discord and check that out. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta check. Is this in Pix's? Hold on. Let me check my... It's not. <laughs> go she added it to her own discord oh my gosh that is too good <laughs> oh man oh that's not it i was looking for a sensor bar <laughs> gave me a different kind of sensor bar <laughs> oh my gosh let's see tiny stitcher oh you're starting this one. Oh dang it I also have this one, but I have the mess up one. I have the mess up one, it's in my stash. Cause it was like on super discount. So I was like, oh, that's a big painting with a lot of amazing diamonds to just pass up for like, I think it was like 20 something dollars. It was very inexpensive for this size painting and everything. And it just, it just wasn't, it was the wrong charting that they made originally. Um, so they, they put that one on clearance and then brought the new charting out. I think you have the new charting. Um, but it's not bad. I mean, it's not terrible. It just wasn't up to their standard. Tell you what are you doing? <laughs> version one, I missed out on that one, but snagged it in version two. So much confetti in version two. I mean, I think version one might still have a lot of confetti. It's just, um, yeah, I think they just did the, the charting wasn't as clear, I guess you could say more than anything else. Um, but yeah, oh, random. Mm, any, mini, miny, mo, catch a tiger by its toe. If it hollers, let it go. I should have said jam. <laughs> any, mini, miny, mo. And my mother said to pick the very best one. And it is you. You get pink. <laughs> you got pink. Love Kiki. I haven't watched Kiki's delivery service. Um, I've seen Totoro. I've seen Spirited Away. And I've seen Howl's Moving Castle. Howl's Moving Castle is my favorite so far. Um, but I've been meaning to finish watching the rest of them. I've been meaning to watch the rest of them. Um, but I, like I said, the painting was just too good of a bargain to like pass up. All good movies. Yeah, I love them all so far. They're all really great. Turkey twerk. Turkey twerk! But yes, yeah, so look at your top. I love the colors that are already up here though. These like pastels and stuff. This corner though. This corner. This AB right here is gorgeous. I assume there's some ABs here as well. Like some white ones. But this color right here is beautiful. Is there more here? I can't tell if there's some in here as well, but they're so shiny. These diamonds are shiny. So much AB, the light blue, white. Oh, the white is fairy dust. I have a pit, my, um, my potion one, the, the love potion has the fairy dust in it. Which is interesting. I'm curious to see it when it's like done. I don't know if I, I placed a few, but. I don't remember where they're at. Oh no, those are ABs. 
Yeah, I don't remember where I saw the, the fairy dust at, if I did them yet. I think I just have ABs on here so far. But I'm curious to see the, the fairy dust drills once I get them on here. But this is the love potion. The one with the corgi. You can see the corgi there. But it's the little witch girl and she's making the, the love potion. This is the one I have going right now. I just haven't worked on it in a while. So pearly, right? This guy's like 70% special drills. The fairy dusts are so pretty. I think they're really, like they look really nice. They're like compacted like glitter. Um, but I haven't seen them like set in a painting like for myself. So I'm curious how they look like in person, like set into a painting. So hopefully I can get the that one like worked on again soon. And I can um I can see like the full effect. Let's see, we got Sleeping Beauty. Oh, this is the one for Sleeping Beauty's son that they're working on. How cute! This is a cute little Pikachu. My daughter would love this. She loves Pikachu. Pikachu is her favorite. I gotta find her a painting with Pikachu on it. I think she would enjoy it a little more. Right now she's doing with one with Elsa. And they used to be big Frozen lovers, but I think they're kind of over it now. But she loves Pikachu, my oldest. So I'll have to find one. This is super cute though. I'm glad that your son is enjoying this, Sleeping Beauty. That's a perfect one. That's a perfect one for kids. We got Kim also having, um, what did it say? My kid did most of the cream and got sick, so I did the rest. Present for Fox, my husband. Oh, that's so sweet. That is so sweet. Oh, this was a mother, a mother, um, a mother daughter project. Such a cute idea. That's really special. This is really, really special. This one has green, yellow, blue, and something else very, oh, that has a lot of colors. I'm wondering if the one that I have also has all those colors, just in a different um, charting. I'm curious. That's adorable, Kim. Her, uh, Kim's uh, husband's username is has fox in it. I believe he loves foxes, I think, from what I remember. Someone's gonna correct me, but um, this is so cute. Might, might, uh, might be red. That's interesting. It's a lot of colors. That's a lot of special diamonds. They've been wilding out on like the special drills um, on recent paintings. I kind of like it. I'm not mad at it. I do enjoy the, the fun diamonds that they put in now. This is so cute, Kim. I love that. Let's see, we have crafting with uh, crafting Sam. Do I know this one? Oh, this is the one with the dragon, Soulmates by DAC. I believe it's a dragon, like a maiden dragon. It kind of reminds me of, um... <sighs> I'm totally blanking. What's her name from um, Arwen? Reminds me of Arwen. My, DA so my DAC order has shipped, let's go. It should get to you very quickly. Usually it doesn't take longer than a week once it's shipped out. You should have it in a couple days. That is so exciting. 7AB and 4 Fairy Dust. That's a lot. Then under the stairs has 4AB and 1 Fairy Dust. Yeah, I think that's how mine is on this one. It's like 4AB, 1 Fairy Dust. I don't remember ever seeing that one as pretty. Yeah, I think it came for like a limited time. I don't know if it's sold out and they haven't restocked it yet or if it was limited edition, which would make more sense. Cause I don't think I've seen this one since it came out too. It's very pretty. This is, um, Ravan, Raven, 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 Raven Felon. I don't know what the name of it is though. Oh, Sam just said it, Soulmates. You could check if you want to check. There's the artist name right there, Raven. Raven Felon, I think. Oh, there's ABs down here in these flowers. That's pretty. Yeah, this is a gorgeous picture. Gorgeous image. Almost halfway it looks like too. 
Got Pocket Roddy! Look at the puppy! New foster puppy, Pomsky named Poe. Look at this face! This is a foster dog? This dog isn't gonna last much longer without a family. This is too cute. They are too cute! Look at the ears! I'm a sucker for like these stand-up ears. <laughs> I've noticed. Ears on dogs are my thing. I don't know why. Back for a minute, Cam! Your your diamond painting for Fox came out so cute. And we love that it was with your daughter. That was so cute. Super adorable. Hey, how is she doing? How is she doing? Is she doing okay? It's super cuddly. Yeah, this one's not gonna last very long, Pocket Roddy. <laughs> tall stand-up ears are the cutest. Yeah, I'm a sucker for the, the tall stand-up ears. I'm starting to realize that. Which is funny because my first dog was a Min Pin Chihuahua mix. And he, I loved his ears, but his ears flopped over. So when he perked up his ears, they were flopped like this. And they would perk up. Otherwise, they were just like floppy down. But when they perked, they would go like that. And it was so cute. But I definitely, I don't know. Ears on dogs are my thing, apparently. It was so cute. Yeah, they're not gonna, they're not gonna be without a home for very long, for sure. My brother's pit lab has Yoda ears! That's even more adorable! She has the flu and double ear infection after starting antibiotics on Saturday. She's doing much better! I'm so happy to hear that. I'm so happy to hear that. She's been sick for so long. That poor thing needs to feel better. But I'm glad, I'm glad that it's helping. Finally. I'm so glad. But yeah, this puppy's adorable. Oh, speaking of Kim. You found it! Starry night, let's go! The old one I need to finish. How much do you have left on this? I see bits of... Oh, I see. You did like bits of color. Yeah, so there's a lot to fill in. This is like waves of confetti. <laughs> Literally. Literally, look at all that. There's a lot of confetti in there. Yeah, you still have a little bit, uh, quite a bit to do. Quite a bit to do still, but... It doesn't look too big, so hopefully it won't take too long to finish this one. Most of it, yeah. Yeah, hopefully it doesn't take too long to finish. You've got this. You've got it. <laughs> tacos. <gasps> you have tacos? <sighs> so jelly. Already in a better mood. Let's freaking go. I also get hangry every once in a while. If it's like all day I haven't eaten and then people start telling me like, Hey, you need to do this. This needs to be done. Where do I find this? I have a bajillion questions. I have a bajillion things I want you to do. Then I get hangry. I'm like, oh, I want to eat. Let me eat. Um, I had spaghetti. I had leftover spaghetti today. I was craving spaghetti. Tomorrow, I need, I might have pork chops tomorrow. Or, um, yeah, pork chops. Pork wings? No, pork chops. I have pork chops tomorrow. Good night, Kim. Have a wonderful sleep. Count all the sheep. I will see you later. Get some good rest. I was a cross stitcher and had no clue what I was doing. Ah, that's fair. That's fair. But yes, get some rest. Have a good day tomorrow, okay? Have a good day tomorrow. I hope work goes by quickly so that Thursday you can have your half day. But get some good rest. Let's see. We got Rainbow. Rainbow, look at you. Gift elf mock build. How cute. And that's what I was thinking. It has to be an elf as soon as I glance at it. How adorable, Rainbow. Look at you! Is this a present? It is a present. What's in the present, Ringbolt? Why is it so long? <laughs> Why is the present so long, Ringbolt? What's in the present? I'm curious. I'm curious. But this is so cute. <laughs> Ian knows what's up. <laughs> Yeah, Ringbolt does a lot of um, 
Lego mock-ups, as well as a lot of chain, uh, chain mail. Where are you? Where are you, Ringbolt? There you go. Go check out Ringbolt. Super chill streams too, but a lot of chain mail and a lot of um, Lego design. Corgi? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Ring bowl. I love the hat too. I just realized it curves over. I just realized that it curves over. That's adorable. Uh, let's see. Crafting Sam with an update on this blanket on row 54 of 71. Oh, you're making progress, Sam. You're definitely making progress. Look at this one. These all are different. Every time I see them, it's a different design. Together, they look really neat. I like the popcorn stitches and the details they give, but I hate doing popcorn stitches. I don't like them. I don't know why. I just don't enjoy them. When you said chainmail, my first thought was those emails people, people would forward chainmail, and then I realized you meant uh, the, the smithing kind. Do you remember those? Those used to be so annoying. We talked about those recently, actually. I forgot when. It was quite a few days ago. Um, we were talking about the old chain mail letters and like sending them. I forget why it came up. But yeah, I remember those. And then you had to write like, oh, write this and send it to like 10 friends to have good luck or whatever it was on there. <laughs> I don't remember. And then we were saying how like, um, how it's annoying. Oh, because we were talking about Facebook and how like parents and like family and friends like still post that stuff like, Oh, I, you know, something bad happened to me. Oh, if you finish reading this, then you're a true friend. I'm actually okay, but I want you to send this, repost this, so I know that you read it, and I know that you're actually a real friend of mine who read it. <laughs> I hate those things so much. I hate them. This demon girl has sent you this email. Send it to 10 people or else you die. <laughs> exactly. I used to hate that so much. So much. But awesome progress, Sam. Awesome progress. Oh, we got some more from Ringbow. It's a cup of cocoa. Cup of so nice hot cocoa. Lego mock style. I love this one. This is fun. Those are so annoying. They're still annoying. I still have people who post that stuff. It is the most annoying thing ever. I'm like, do you really need like to do that? If you want attention, just say you want attention. Like, if you don't think people are li are reading your stuff, then just delete them off your Facebook. <laughs> I love the marshmallows too. That was really creative. Was the marshmallows in this? This is a really fun one. Here's another one. Sledding down the hill. <laughs> I love the bars. Look at the bars. The handles. These are so fun, Ringbolt. Oh, you have quite a few. You've been busy. You've been real busy. I like the handles on this. I think that's fun with the little cording. Whatever piece that is, that's an interesting piece. Uh, we got a Nutcracker. Oh, Toy Soldier, sorry. It's a Toy Soldier. So cute. You have been making so much, um, oops, so much progress on, the, on all of these. Look at that. It's been a while since I've seen the mock-ups from Rainbow, too. And then we have another one here. Ginger gingerbread house. I love the gingerbread house. Love the gingerbread house. What a cool little collection you've got. I like these, like, triangle pieces. I wonder if those would be individual or if there's actually one piece that's, like, one full one here. I wish I could zoom in. It doesn't let me. But yeah, it's like a triangle under the roof. I'm wondering if it's single pieces or not. Super cool. Rainbow, these are amazing. Congrats on all these finishes. Congrats. Ian! Ian! <gasps> you do pottery, Ian? Ian! You do pottery? It means you're good with your hands. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting, Ian. These came out so nice, though. Look how even and pretty they look. Oh, these are really neat. Oh, 
Is this a class that you're doing? I do, Ao. <laughs> Is this a class? No, they're all nice. They're all really, really nice. Ceramics are so fun. I know a couple streamers on here that do ceramics, but they don't stream as much anymore. At least I don't see them often. There was one I really liked, and she was so sweet. She had very, very calm, chill streams. Um, she had raided me once. I forget her name now. But I haven't seen her on since the time that I like hung out over there afterward. But it was really cool to like watch. Oh my god, iron! <laughs> Iron! I'm chillin'! <laughs> Iron! What are you doing, Iron? What? What? I love a spinning wheel. It's the best. There were a lot of ceramic streamers, but kind of halfway through the year, they all seemed... Right? That wasn't just me, right? There was quite a few. I'm chillin'. Hi, chillin'. How you doing, chillin'? <laughs> I see you. I see you. Yeah, they all dropped off and she was so sweet and I really enjoyed her stream. But I hadn't seen her since, sadly. I actually started on Twitch watching ceramic streamers but made my way to fiber and fabric when they left. There's a lot though. There's a lot of different, um, uh, a lot of different things in the makers and crafters. I've seen all kinds of stuff. I've seen someone who does like, um, what do you call it? Like the glass making? The like window panes and stuff? The glass... I don't remember the term. But I've seen someone who does glass. I've seen someone who does... Um, I know someone right now working on this giant biome that's insane. I've been seeing a lot more uh, model, model painters. What do you call them? I always forget that name too. Um, but they do like the little like Warhammer uh, models and they paint them. I've been seeing a lot of people doing that lately. A few glass makers, yeah. Miniature, thank you. I always forget that term. Uh, miniatures, miniature painters. I've been seeing a lot of them lately. Finish book seven of Ice Planet Barbarians. Next seven are waiting for delivery. What have you shown me? Apparently your new kink spell. <laughs> Apparently, I've shown you your new kink. <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> you're welcome. I'm glad you're enjoying. <laughs> Got into crafting through Duo. <laughs> he raided into Zakayla and you, and I've gotten way more into crafting roots. I love that. Who? Yeah, Duo is my first um, streamer that I kind of found on my own. Because when I came over to Twitch, I came over because of Volchi. Because he was streaming. So he wanted my he wanted my tab. He wanted my view. And so I found a, um, a tarot reader. And I was watching him for a long time. He's a very big tarot reader now. He does He's like a Twitch ambassador. Um, so I watched him for a while. And then it wasn't until Michelle Bendy and Rachel Ray uh, were like, Oh, we're going over to Twitch to do live streaming. And I was like, oh, I'm already on Twitch, so might as well like give them a follow and then I can watch their live streams. And then when I realized like there was a make, that's how I found the makers and crafters area. And I was like, this was here the whole time and I didn't even know. And so Duo was the first one I found because I saw him cross stitching. And I was like, oh, that's so interesting. Like, I've never, there's, well, it's not that I've never seen a male cross-stitcher. I knew a few, like, uh, Stitchman Darcy and, um, who's the other one who does the, uh, the cross-stitch design over there on YouTube? I'm, I know his name is, like, very popular. I'm forgetting it right now. Um, and there was somebody else. No, it's not Bart. It was the one who does the, um, the sows every year. Uh, what's his name? Stitchman Darcy talks about him a lot. They're like friends. I'm forgetting his name. I know, I know as soon as I think about him, I'm like, oh my god, that's what it is. Um, what's his name? Joseph? No, it's not Joseph. I don't remember. But there's a couple. And, um, 
So when I saw one on Twitch, I was like, oh, that's so cool. Like, there's actually, like, a guy cross-stitching. Let me go, like, hang out. Jacob, thank you, Vintage. That's exactly who it is from uh, Modern Folk Embro Embroidery. I know who he was. And then there was a couple new ones, like, starting up. But when I saw a duo, I was like, I am so impressed that there's a male cross-stitching. So let me go hang out and see who they are. And as soon as I entered, I followed. And he was like, hey, he's like, uh, we got our Discord. Join the Discord. And I was like, sure. <laughs> What's Discord? <laughs> so I made a Discord and I, like, hopped in. And I think I shared something, I don't remember. But like he was so personable and he was like, actually like, even though he had like a lot of people in there and stuff, he was like, I knew he was talking to me. And so I was like really enjoying it. And then I think after that I found Pix and um, a couple other people. And that's how it started. But yeah, Duo was my first as well. Ayo. <laughs> but uh, it's crazy, it's crazy. And here we are, here we are. And it, you know what's funny is like, um, he was actually my first big raid. And um, I like fangirled like so hard. <laughs> Cause I was like, oh my gosh, like Duo, Duo's actually raiding me. Like this is wild. Like, and then now we talk. Now now Duo's like a like a total friend. He's like one of my my goodest, goodest friends here on Twitch, what do you call it? He's one of my greatest friends here on Twitch, and it's like, it's it's bizarre to think, like, how much I, like, first met him and looked up to him, like, oh gosh, like, he's like this big-ass streamer. I made a Discord after I started watching streamers on Twitch. I started watching Twitch after a few YouTubers I watched mentioned it. Yeah, everybody started migrating over after a little bit. I don't know if a lot of them have stayed or not. I haven't been on YouTube as much to find out, but... It's been really interesting and I'm I'm glad that that I you know made that journey over myself because I was on YouTube too and I was like Volchi was like well why don't you try it like there's a makers and crafters try it out and see if you like it and I was like all right like what do I have to lose I don't have any traction on YouTube I mean I have a following but it wasn't like it's not like here it's not like here you did YouTube too vintage did you do a lot of floss too? I had started with um, sewing tutorials and then from sewing tutorials I found diamond painting and uh, I found diamond painting during the pandemic. So I started doing diamond painting reviews and then from there I found cross stitching and so that's when I started with floss tube. And so I was doing floss tube for a little while and and then I came over to Twitch. Did floss too. That's so wild. Yeah, it was hard to get anything over there. Like I said, I have a following over there, but it's not like here. It's not the same like comparison. Like the following over there would be like, say if I'm like, I have a hundred followers here. I guess that would make sense, kind of. I started one with a friend, but that fell apart. So then I did one by myself, but I hate editing videos. Same vintage. <laughs> Same. I hated editing. And I was very, very particular about the editing I wanted done. So it was just like, I'd rather be creating content than sitting here editing videos. Hated the lack of interaction. Exactly that too. I had a few people that always watched my videos, but it was like, you know, they would say like, oh, I love this. And it'd be like, oh, thank you. You know, I appreciate it or whatever. Or like, oh yeah, it's this. And then that would be it until the next video. <laughs> it was really, really frustrating. I think I hopped onto a random Twitch stream and then raided into Pixie and found the rest of the pug, the pug club through her. That is so cool. I didn't find Pixie till more recently. I think I knew of her for a long, long time. Uh, just like Moko Maid. I, I knew of Moko Maid since I first got on Twitch, but I didn't understand them. <laughs> I didn't understand them at the time. So I wasn't, I wasn't around. YouTube isn't very good for crafting unless you're only doing tutorials. Exactly. And even then, like, you, you wouldn't know. It takes so much time and effort to, like, create something and make the tutorial and then 
edit the tutorial and make sure you have all the information in the tutorial to only get, you know, if it's not something interesting, it's all that work is wasted. Um, some of my biggest videos that I still get a lot of views on now is my petticoat tutorial and my dog harness tutorial that I did. Um, if anything else, it's my dirndl, dirndl, the, the dresses that Germans wear for festivals and, um, I forget what you call them. They're not festivals. They're called, um, there's a term for them. Um, but I had a tutorial for that and the only other one is like my Sailor Moon tutorial. <laughs> Those are the ones that still get a lot of views. Everything else is like here and there. Chubby Marshmallow, how are you? How are you doing? How was your weekend? I like, like watching... Nerd Forge is really cool, yes. Prickly Alpaca, that name sounds familiar. And Rachel Maxi for both crafting and entertainment purposes though. I know the first one, yeah. Durndle, Durndle. Yes, I, so the funny thing is with that video, it's a popular video, but when I made it, I wasn't pronouncing it correctly and I wrote the name wrong and that's probably why I was pronouncing it incorrectly because I didn't realize that I had, I had written it wrong. I see you, Noted. That's one for tonight, but I think I fixed it. Almost! <laughs> <laughs> Almost. Um, and so throughout the video, I say it wrong. Uh, but I was able to fix the thumbnail, but my original starting scene still has it written wrong. And the thing is, is that a lot of people watch it and then they get, they leave comments and they're like, it's pronounced this and you're pronouncing it wrong. At least say it correctly. And so... It sucks because a lot of people do appreciate that video. I have a lot of comments on there where they're like, I've been looking for something for this tutorial for forever. Like, thank you, this helps so much. And I have so many of those, but I also get a lot of the hate ones just because I said it incorrectly. Um, so yeah, so I turned off, uh, I forget who suggested it because I mentioned it before in here. And they were like, just turn off the comments. And I was like, that's actually probably not a bad idea. Because I'd hate to take down the whole video. Because it does have, like, the tutorial is really good. Like, it really does help a lot of people showing the tutorial. And I'd hate to, like, take that away from people. Because um, it was hard for me to find tutorials to make it. So, I, I was like, yeah, if I take off the comments, maybe that'll help. <laughs> can't see thumbs down no one can see the thumbs down so <laughs> doesn't matter doesn't matter now but yeah welcome back rainbow i was saying all your stuff looked really great we were looking at all your mock-ups they all looked amazing you were you've been very busy but all your stuff looked really really cool i like the hot cocoa yes all your stuff was great I make my chat build extra long, so you see any dots on the far right? Yes, I do. Oh, is that me? Like, if I make it smaller, it'll look... Oh! If I make it smaller, it fits. <laughs> hey, y'all! <laughs> yeah, it's because mine is spread real wide, too. <laughs> <laughs> if you are from a place where you shouldn't be expected to pronounce those things perfectly so don't ever worry about it. yeah I I've, I've, I've felt so bad <laughs> I felt so bad but that's why they were saying like I could tell like they were coming in they were just like that's just the vibe of YouTube though that's why I think I I I really was happy to like get away from it is because that's kind of the vibe of YouTube like there's a lot of keyboard warriors over there, and a lot of them are gonna, you know, they're gonna say some nasty things just because they can. Um, compared to here on Twitch, like, if someone comes in and starts saying nasty stuff, like, we just ban them. <laughs> you just ban them and they're gone. But, like, YouTube, you can't do that as easily. 
So it's kind of like, oh, like, why are you deleting all the nasty comments? You know what I mean? Like, they get really bad over there. So YouTube is just such a different vibe. It was hard to, like, connect with people. And, like, editing myself, like, I'm me, but I'm not, like, truly being me. Because I'm editing out all my mistakes, all my, like, things. And I'm kind of just, like, talking, t like, tutorial-wise, you know? I'm not really, like, being me. I'm just kind of doing what needs to be done in the videos and stuff. At least I ain't splitting the rows anymore. This is true. This is true. You got it, Noah. Look at you. Look at you go. Honestly, why even waste your time commenting? So that, that's what I'm saying. Like, YouTube is a different beast. Make the damn dress. People are just too, too much sometimes. They really are. But YouTube, that's just the vibe over there, unfortunately. That's how they are. The weekend is good besides ending up in the hot. What? Nothing too serious? I hope not. I hope not. I'm sorry you had to go, though. I'm sorry you had to go. If it wasn't nothing, anything too crazy, I'm still sorry you had to go, end up going in the first place. But I'm glad it was good otherwise. Oh my gosh, Chubby Marshmallow. That doesn't sound great. <laughs> but I'm glad it was okay. I'm glad. I hope you're okay. I hope everything's all right. But yeah, that's how they are. That's how they are. They'll leave just comments. I think I made a, a Joanne's coupon video and someone was just like, is this a joke? And I was just like, wow. <laughs> she was like, who are these people that, that thumbs up this thumbs up this video? And I was like, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, it's very, very sad over there. It was just a really infected... Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. Oh, I hope you took care of that then. That's really uncomfortable. I hope you took care. I hope it, everything is okay with it now. Understandable. But anyways, Ian, these are amazing. Hanchi! Hanchi! Happy gamer lag crafting! <laughs> Hanchi! Thank you so much for gifting subs! Oh my gosh! You got Monster Parker, Maeve Brown, Michael Mantis, Sobel, Tadat Tut, <gasps> Dr. Butters, Mary Cat, Grateful Vanessa, Imperfect! Let's go! And you got Mia in there. Thank you so much for the gift subs. Um, how are you? <laughs> how are you doing? Yes? Happy belated Christmas holiday season. <laughs> Thank you. That is so sweet. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you. Thank you. How are you? How are you doing? Welcome in. <laughs> Welcome in. As we're just hanging out. I'm, I'm on late today too. Usually I'm off at 11.30, but whatever. My kids aren't, they don't gotta be up early. And I've been staying up real late. So we're gonna get through Discord. We're actually almost done. We're actually almost done. But Ian, these came out amazing. These are really, really cool. I would love to see more. But thank you so much, Hunchy. I hope you're doing well. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see, we got spells. There it goes. I got a new Kindle Paper White with the adjustable warmness for the black light and promptly made six stickers to cover it. Oh, this is so cool spells. Look at all the bluey stickers. Look at all the bluey stickers. So cute. This freaking ad, yo. Should I run it now and get it over with? Let me run it now. Let me get over this ad. Hold on. I'm just going to run it. Wait. Trying to breathe again. Saw dust. Clumps are not fun to breathe in. Why are you breathing in sawdust clumps? <laughs> That's not good. That's not good. I hope you're okay. <laughs> to be fair, that would totally be me too. So I shouldn't be talking. <laughs> what are you doing with sawdust? Are you crafty? Are you doing some crafts right now? Hold on. Let me run this ad and get this ad out of the way. Okay. Let me run it. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm running it. 
Let's get it out of the way. We can finish up. We're almost done with this core. Let's Bless you. <laughs> Bless you, dog. Alright. Yeah, we'll let the we'll let the ad run. Like I said, we got a couple more things here with Discord and then um we'll probably head out in a bit. Like I said, I'm not in a I'm not in a rush today. Alright. Who am I gonna raid though? I'm not sure. Let me see who's on. There's somebody on that I always like think about raiding and I never do. Because somebody else always ends up popping on. Maybe we'll go there today since we're chilling. Oh, I'm just looking. See, there's always somebody else on. <laughs> and I'm like, ooh, they're on right now though too. We'll see, we'll see who's left on when we're done. I just want to go show support to them. Cause I, I haven't had a chance to to raid them at all. I mean, I haven't done it, but they're very awesome. They're awesome people. Got 10 seconds. Um, but yeah, so we'll see. We'll see if we go there. Otherwise, I have someone playing Stardew Valley. Um, who is a Mocha Loco. I have two people that are Mocha Locos that are on. The other one's doing art. But I have never really hung out with them, so I don't know. We'll see. Welcome back, everyone! Trying to fix a laser cutter, cutter and cleaning the back end isn't fun. <gasps> a laser cutter? That sounds like fun. Minus the cleaning part. <laughs> Minus the cleaning part. Are you working on something right now? Do you have anything to show? I would love to see if you have any, um, any projects, project pictures. Laser cutter. I actually need to get into learning and practicing with my 3D printer. That's what I need to pick up again. Fancy schmancy, fancy, fancy schmancy. <laughs> I only know of Derek from Moco Made who has a laser cutter. I don't know if I know anybody else who does anything with laser cutters. But he does a lot of leather working. I think that's what he uses it mostly for, is the leather working. It's a non-brand Chinese machine that has been flogged that my brother picked up cheap. Hey, I mean, <laughs> that worked out perfectly then. That worked out perfectly. If it works, it works. <laughs> Are you also a Moco, Mo a Moco Made fan? Are you also a Moco Made fan? I think I saw you use that one earlier. I love that emote. Yeah, I think Derek's the only other one I know who does um, has a laser cutter. I don't know if I, I don't know if I know anybody else who has one. I'm curious. One day when I have my giant craft room of things, I will have all the all the toys. <laughs> a local pallet company. I mean, it worked out. If you got one for cheap, it worked out. Sometimes that's nice when things like that happen. But I love your stickers, Spells. I love your stickers. Here's some more. Oops. This is the Smut Book one, isn't it? Hold on. I gotta close some of these. Hold on. I have a lot of browser sources open. Hold on. Oh, shoot. I made it too big. <laughs> I made it too big. Let's get rid of these. I'm making my computer work. There we go. There's the bluey one. Is this one? Yes, this is the, the smut book one. This one has all the smut book stuff on it. <laughs> and then this is the tablet. Ooh, let's go. The coworker? The coworker? It's gotta be a rough work. The coworker? What is this one about, Spells? What is this about? 5k machine for 200 oh that's a big ass deal can't complain definitely can't complain about that 
Only issue is I don't know what has died on the laser side of things. I have no idea. It's a mystery thriller. Oh, really? Oh, now that sounds really interesting, too. Someone you work with, and it's like they're a murderer. <laughs> yeah, that's actually a really great steal. I don't know, though. I don't know what you could do to figure it out. I mean, YouTube will only get you so far. Um, Reddit, maybe? Reddit? Reddit usually has a lot of um, accurate answers sometimes. Want the back of the book? You mean what it's about? It's okay. I probably won't read it because it doesn't have smut. <laughs> Honestly, honestly, I probably won't because it doesn't have smut in it. I have a long TBR. I've reached out to a company that fixes machines. Not sure if I'll get a rip. Oh, I hope they respond. I hope they're not jerks and they respond then. Hopefully, manifesting that for you. I hope they respond. <laughs> ah, there it is. There it is. The co-worker. Oh wait, I probably shouldn't show this, huh? Do, 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 do. In case it shows something. Two women. An office filled with secrets. One terrible crime that can't be taken back. <laughs> I'll leave this here. I'll read it when we're done. Let's see, Mom, Mama Spells made two digital paintings and my bro made flowers for Mom out of bottle caps. <gasps> Wait a minute! How cute! Your mom does digital painting? That's amazing! This is adorable! Your mom is really good at this. Look, here's the other one. <gasps> Get out of here. Your mom is amazing. Is your mom a big artist? These are both really nice. Does she's freaking good. She's freaking good. Both of these, they're, they're different styles a little bit, but they're both amazing. Like I can see this as like, this is in right now, this sort of like style. This is in, I see a lot of this on like stickers and stuff. This? Look at that! Very talented spells. Your mom is very talented. Used to do traditional ones too. I get my craft art from, from her. That is so sweet. Pictures and crafts of what I was able to do before machine died! Okay, we're gonna we're gonna check that out. I showed her procreate and she's obsessed. I love that. Best $10 purchase ever. Yeah, Procreate is amazing. Um, I have it on my daughter's iPad because she also loves art. She hasn't gotten into it too much yet. Um, I think because she doesn't understand all the buttons and stuff. She's only seven, so it's understandable. They have a lot in Procreate. Um, but we got her the Apple Pencil and, and stuff for when she's ready to like wanting, wanting to explore it. Um, she, she loves art, so we're trying to nurture that with her. But your mom is amazing. That is awesome. Beautiful. And then this one with the bottle caps. These are bottle caps? No way. Those are bottle caps? They're like little metal flowers. How cute. I'm thinking of getting her the button shortcut for the E button. Wait, the button shortcut for Procreate? What is the button shortcut? What is that? But these are really cute too. These are bottle caps, that's interesting. I would have never guessed what these are made out of. They look like just metal, like metal flowers. It's a little keyboard, 15 keys to help with, oh yeah, that would be amazing. Your mom would love that, I think, for sure. For some like quick shortcut buttons, that would be perfect. Very cute spells, awesome stuff. We got Sleeping Beauty. Oops. 
My dad made me these for Christmas. They're some of the bands. We've gone to sea together. Sleeping Beauty, that is such a sweet thing to do. You've seen Kid Rock. I don't know who this is. Papa Roach, Alice in Chains, Grand Funk Railroad, Dirty Honey. That is such a sweet idea. Shine Down, Disturbed, Spirit Box, Mega Death. Who is this? Ginger? And Breaking Benjamin. The only ones I've seen is Disturbed. And I've seen, I think I was supposed to see Breaking Benjamin, but we didn't make it to their set. I've, and I've seen Alice in Chains. How freaking fun. This is such a great idea. Megadeth? No, I didn't see Megadeth. I saw Slayer. Slayer is the other older one. I think I was supposed to see Megadeth, but I didn't go to that one after all. I think that's what happened. This is a great idea. I love this. What a great way to like remember those times together. That is so sweet. Ginger is good. I've never heard of Ginger. Oh, is it Five Finger Death Punch? I'm an idiot. I have seen Five, five Finger Death Punch as well. I've, I saw them the same time as... Um, uh, disturbed because they were at the um, they were at a festival together headlining. They're the only concert I've been to. Really, who? These are so fun, right? This is a great idea. I love this so much. This is beautiful. Let's see, we got a couple more here from who? Look at the whale jewelry! This is adorable! I'm telling you, who you have like you like knock out knock out um jewelry so quickly. Look at that. Very pretty. Oh, I like this one. This gives me um I don't know why it gives me Moana vibes. Oops. So pretty. I love the blue on this. Did the earrings last night and also finished stating the bookcase and craft table this morning. <gasps> bookcase, let's go. And a craft table. Where's the craft table? Is it this one? No, these are all bookcases, no? Is this a craft table right here? This one? That's super cool, right? If we made if he made one for each band we've seen, I have way too many coasters. You know what would be cool though? Would be to like line them up and like make like a giant wall art or something with them. If you have a big wall in your house somewhere, that would be really cool too. I made the earrings for my mom and her three daughters. The little one, there's a flap in front that go Oh, okay, now it makes sense. I think I kind of see it there, actually, now that you say that. Oh, I'd love that. You You said you were staining them, right? Staining them, yes. That's awesome, who? Let's freaking go. And your earrings are always gorgeous. And then, of course, last but not least, look at his ears! This is what we were talking about, the dog's ears. This is Ian's dog. They are definitely Yoda ears. These are the most accurate Yoda ears that I've ever seen. <laughs> Those are the most accurate Yoda ears ever. All right, let me find um, hunchy stuff. Here we go. He's so cute though, look at his face. Is that pit chocolate lab mix? Look at the face though. So stoic, such a stoic face. It was our first time making furniture, but I think we did okay. You did great. That's your first time making furniture. Get out of here. Get out of here, lies. <laughs> he sealed them with citrus scented cutting board oil. So they're food safe. That is so great. I love that you have someone you can craft with. I love that. He's got a little bow tie too. He has a little bow tie. 
You know, citrus is my favorite. Oh, that's a that's adorable. That's sweet. That's sweet. They're too amazing to be a first time. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Those are way too amazing to be a first piece. My granddad helped a lot when he came to visit. He has way more experience. He does a ton of fine furniture and jewelry boxes, etc. I see, I see, I see, I see. Oh, that's nice too. My father-in-law is a contractor. Um, oh, oh my god, iron! <laughs> I am a bit distracted here. Bad girl sheep, bad girl iron. sheep. Oh dear, can't believe you forgot like Scaring that. the shit out of me, iron! Um, my father-in-law is a contractor, so he works on like big, big homes in LA and um, Hollywood and all that kind of stuff. Um, so yeah, whenever I need something like we, me or Volchi need help like building something or putting something together. Thank you for the hydrate. He is like where we go to and we're like, how do you do this? <laughs> or when he comes to visit, he is like so happy to like help build things and stuff. He loves it. I don't have that routine. <laughs> I don't have that command. He's so freaking cute. He's so cute. And then this is what Hunchy was working on. This is really nice. Life is short. Lick the bowl. That's actually facts. You should definitely lick everything. <laughs> you should definitely be licking everything. This is really, really nice though. With a laser cutter. That is so cool. One day. One day I'll have... Sorry, my hair was in my arm. <laughs> One day, I will have all the toys. This is on the list. For legal reasons, it is not placed in the bathroom. <laughs> fair. That's fair. Always like the bowler plate. Always. Always. Thank you for sharing. I'm sorry it broke though. That's so frustrating. That is so frustrating. I hope you can get it fixed soon, honestly. But this is so pretty. This is really cool. I like it. Thank you everyone for sharing. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You know I enjoy this. I get really like inspired. You all know this. I get inspired seeing what everybody is working on. Um, all right. Let me see who's on at this current moment. Like I said, my my one person that I always want to go see is on. They do tarot reading. They're a tarot reader. Um, very, very calm streams. Very chill. They're in Australia, which is why they always start stream at like 11 o'clock for me. So they're usually... <laughs> Let's go, Toya. Toya's still ready to party. <laughs> Masterpiece in before... I know, at least you got it done before it broke. Facts. Um, but yeah, they're a tarot reader. So I think I want to go there today and just so show some love because I, I do enjoy them and I try very much to like spend time over there. It's just always late. But... Um, We'll go over to Blue Light Oracle. Like I said, they're a tarot reader. Um, on Saturdays, they do community reading. So they literally read for like the community and stuff if you're into like that kind of thing. Um, tomorrow, I will be on same time. Well, I might go on a little earlier. My kids aren't wilding out. I might be on a little earlier because we're getting back into Baldur's Gate. Now, keep in mind all new friends. I am usually crafting. You saw what we did today. I'm usually crafting. <laughs> um, but I've done a lot of whips this year and I've, I've finished a lot of projects and I've been really, really, really wanting to get through and try Boulder's Gate. So I started it. We're a couple streams in now. Um, but since I have this time where I don't have to like run off or like be in bed early or like end stream at a certain time because my kids are home. I've been really getting into Baldur's Gate and having longer streams throughout the week. So I might start a little earlier tomorrow night. Um, and we'll be doing Baldur's Gate at least for the next couple days. I'm really, really excited. I will be not multi-streaming to YouTube so we can put the nudity on. <laughs> 
so we can put the nudity on and watch the jiggle mechanics, okay? <laughs> Chaos with the sight of crowd. That's usually how it is here, honestly. But right now it's 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 chaos with the side of, of smut gaming. <laughs> That's what we're doing. I'm a terrible gamer, but I do I do wanna wanna romance some peeps. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying. Alright, let me get this started. So that'll be this week, but normally once the year starts over and the minions go back to school, you'll see me more doing like craft streams more than anything else. That's usually what we do here. <laughs> Um, but let's go to blue. Like I said, blue is so sweet. Super chill streams. You, I have a, I have a terror redeem. So if you think this is weird, I, I actually do have a terror redeem. Um, let's get this started. There we go. 2024, you're a gaming. Well, Baldur's Gate will not end. I just probably won't be on as long as I would like to be more than anything else. Um, I'll have to designate a specific day to do gaming. So it won't go away. It would just, I won't be able to spend as much time on it. Thank you, Iron. Thank you so much. Thank you, Notewood. There's the raid messages. I said, I'll be back tomorrow. I'm back Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday will be a day stream. Um, Saturday, I'll be on with Casa for the Deep House stuff. Um. There we go. There's the information for the Deep Hell 24 next year. I'll be over there on her stream um, kitting up our diamond paintings. So make sure you drop a follow so you can come hang out. I will also post in the Discord when I go live over there as well. So if you get those, you'll see me over there. No you picks! No you picks! Thank you everyone for hanging out. I had so much fun today. The things I do for all of you. <laughs> The things I do for all of you. Let me give a shout out to Blue real quick. In case you get left behind, this is where we're going. There we go. Um, but yeah, I hope to see you tomorrow. If I don't, have a wonderful rest of your week. Recover from the holiday. And I'll see you soon, hopefully. But thank you so much. I adore you all. Bye.